Hi, I have E. Horner here with Nancy from Little Treasures by Nancy. And today mm -hmm. I'm playing dolls and Nancy is going to be playing with books. And if you've been uh, watching her video about how she's making this library thing, how is she going to make all those books? She's got some great tips for you today. So I'm throwing it your way, Nancy. Hello, everyone. I'm going to switch to the top camera so you can see what I'm working on. One more second. I'm just going to give you the big, hang on real quick. If it works out that way. Let's see if that works. There we go. I, I was looking online to, to, to find, you know, different covers to print. I found a couple pages, places that, that give you um, this one here. This is just generic, old-fashioned books actually it like that and then i found another one that has like you know some paperbacks and i got some some modern ones mm -hmm. and i also got some album covers i love it I'll, I'll, list, I'll list those down below and one of the ladies that was um that i got the the printables from gave me a good tip instead of having to use um copy paper oh that was that was weird let me lower this down a little bit more there Instead of using copy paper to do your book pages, I already used this book. I took the cover off to do my um, junk journal, and I used this book for you know writing and gluing. And so it's 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 not, it's just a junk book. The edges here, you see how you have all this. Oh, that's extra pages. Your margins, yeah. The margins here. Uh -huh. All you gotta do is glue. What I did here is glue the edge here to the edge of the paper. Right. Mm -hmm. Find out how many pages you need for the spine, and then cut that off. And I found out that I can cut this with my my little saw. Let me show you real quick. I'll need a new blade because this one this one's been cutting wood. For her right. Work. So I'll, let's I'll say new... hey to some people real quick. We've got Jason who jumps on here really early. Good to see you, Jason. And he said hi to both of us. And then we also have Robin who said she'll be popping in and out as soon as I can find her. Say hey, everyone. So Robin's at work, so she'll just jump in and out when she gets a chance. And we have Liz, which I saw Liz. I miss anybody? Don't let me miss anybody. Miss anybody. Carmen and Erica. Oh, the, okay. Yep. We have Erica has joined us. Hello, Erica. Hi, all with little uh, doll fairy crafter. And we have, and she's saying that to get her Nancy, but she, it's Carmen, cool. Carmen, per, per, There's Carmen right there. Hi, Carmen. Thanks for being here. So, and uh, there's more no, people. We'll say hi to you too. Not yet, Carmen. Um, I, I bought, I got some more Jenga blocks. So that's one of my projects I want to work on. So <gasps> try to come up with some angel wings. Oh my gosh. That's going to be quite the project. Oh, wow. So I got. I ate my books. Did anybody see where I put the books? No, oh, no, don't even. Uh, <laughs> you took them with you. Did you take them with you over there? No, okay, so I brought this, this all back this way. You, you did. Okay. Um, no idea. That is, hang on a sec. I can go back and watch the video. So I'm going to go back and watch our video, figure out where she put her <laughs> things. I'm serious. That is like, I would have to do that. <clears throat> that is so weird. I know it. Anyway, if we are having trouble with audio, y'all always please let us know. While she looks for her doll, while she looks for her books, I'll talk a little bit about my doll. So yes, I worked on her during another live stream where I did her in that nude color uh, yarn, that flat uh, ribbon yarn that I had. Didn't like it. Kept thinking, guys, guys, why would guys? This looks such a good idea. So what? This is the weirdest story. So I have all this gauze. This used to be in a row like one like big flat row this came from a bunch of stuff my grandmother had who was a nurse and i just had some like weird stuff so where i have like you know if you've ever seen me with hemostats and things like that that was like stuff that belonged to her and this was with some stuff and why i hoarded it for she was been dead since i was like 17 or 16 or something like that that many years i've hoarded this weird piece of gauze just with arts and crafts supply and i found it and i washed it and it all came clean it just had some light dust on it it wasn't like dirty and i unrolled it and had to wash it 
So it came out and they made her because I do want the white body. So I have some interesting things that I did to kind of make that together. But yeah, the nude body color, not working for this doll. And so today I'm working on her hair, which is this ridiculous color red. I'm actually having a hard time <laughs> finding a good red. Let me switch over real quick. Did you find your things, by the way? Yeah, I like the red more. that I like. And this is kind of colored red, but it's the closest to what I want her to look like. So this is the pelt I will be using for her hair and probably one of the children. And I will add some other color into it as well. Not just red. I'm going to have some orange highlights. I'm going to have some fun with this. So you get to watch. <laughs> That's what I'm playing with today. Oh, and by the way, I scratched my girl's face. And I know it's not going to show, but oh my gosh, I scratched it. And I have to fix it. And it's not fixing. So we'll put us both on equal sizes. There we go. Now, what, did you find them? Yeah, we're on the floor. Ugh. So what, uh, what I do is just put it into my saw. And slide it over. And cut again. Oh, this one fell apart. Because I, I was trying to glue it. But look. Oh, it's just adorable. And then you can kind of get a fingernail file if you want to do a little distressing on it and stuff like that. Yeah, a, a bit. That's the other thing I, I felt. Mike is here. Hi, Mike. Oh, Mike, you're always just in time. Hello, Mike. Good to see you. Uh, let's see what he says. Have you ever shot the doll's <laughs> head? Uh, nope, no, but it's not in here. It's in my house. I keep it in my house. I have a great shrunken head that I made. He is the most awesome. It was for the play uh, South Pacific. And I did some props for that. And I did this amazing shrunken head for that. I love my shrunken head so much. And so I do have that I one. I didn't think you were, you were going to say yes. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> but you're talking about the shrinking the heads. I know that people do take the uh, Monster High dolls, and not joking aside, but they take the Monster High dolls and they are able to shrink them in acetone. So that is kind of a thing, but not in a creepy way, but it's actually a very beneficial way. And I didn't get my good haircut and scissors. All right. I used a vintage photo of, um, from Tim Holtz and darken the edges of the paper. Mm -hmm. And then because when you cut the, the cover, there's a white core so right. that, that, that also hides it. So, so far, look, I have. She just, now she's just going to be whipping out those books like crazy. The books with pages. And I, I kind of did some playing around when I was like in the airplane. I, I went to Austin this weekend. So I drew, I worked on some book covers of my own for using vintage books that I found on eBay. And I kind of, you know, made the covers so they'll be printable. So I am working on something like that. I just haven't gotten finished with it yet. But that's just a little fun something. So I'm going to get a, a new blade because this one has been cutting wood for, you know, over two years. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah, it's time. It's time. But it's still doing good. Can you imagine having to cut this by hand? Mm. I know. And I, I like the idea of the tools are very nice, aren't they? Look at that. See how she, uh. what I do. See how they the, the, there's white. How how it's white on the edge mm -hmm. so what i do is now take the this this distress oxide and just cover the edges so it looks like more like an older book so you see yes perfect so what i did is i glued it and i glued it opposite i'm going to create that part so first hi elia hi Lola. part and you know glue that so i'm going to let that dry for a minute and set her to the side. So while I went to see my son in Austin and he had to work. And so while he was at work, we got there early. We got there around noon Friday. And so it took him to lunch and then he didn't get off till later. So while we had that span and we're heading back to the hotel, I said, I'm hitting some thrift stores on the way home. And what did Jerry learn? Oh, that. Um, uh, I'm going to mute myself for, to cut more. Okay. Huh? I'm going to mute so I can cut more. Okay. So I, that I am spoiled rotten when it comes to my uh, rolling heels because our prices are awesome. And here uh, in Austin, it was like, oh my gosh, 
Goodwills are the worst too. Their prices were so high, but it's still so much less than if you bought retail. I mean, I know it is, but it was just not interesting. It just did not get me, but I found a Savers. So I was really excited about that. And I also found another little thrift store and all my stuff kind of got thrown in the bag together. So I got to figure it out as I go. A little, that, a little thrift store that was supporting a, a no-kill shelter. So of course I had to go to that one and check it out and buy something. Come on. Because you know, I got support. I do have a, uh, a lot of Barbies, a lot of naked Barbies, because that's what we like. Hey, Lola. Lola's here. So she's coming in. Oh, Lola, would you come in and say, hey, Liz. <gasps> and look, Jens is here. Hello to you. And there is Lola is here saying hey to people. So good to see y'all here. Thank y'all so much for coming. Hang on. <laughs> Before I accidentally hit the wrong thing. Okay. So I do have like a lot of Barbie clothes and accessories that I got. So that was fun. Like I said, the prices were really a lot higher than I normally pay, but it was still fun to get a lot of clothes. Not that they're that great. And I kind of did a video of me opening um, some of the stuff on, and I just haven't put it together. But I just want to give you all a little show and tell. Some people are still dressed. This is a this is one I don't see a lot of ever. And I had to look her up and she needs a good hair washing. But she was a uh, unicorn. And she has like a headband. looks like a unicorn. But she's got the coolest hair. Erica, I hope you're still on there. Because, I mean, check out this hair. But, yeah, it it's definitely needs some love. Needs some washing and kind of bringing her back. And I can't say I do real great with these dolls. I do want to repaint one. Uh as far as selling them and all that, but I was digging her dress. I saw more. I thought about the more like, I really like her dress. These dolls hair usually does not hold up well. So well, I'll see what I can do. Wash her up. And then she's got the gloves, which I don't, I'm not a big fan of, but it'd be a fun repaint. I have some other ones like her. I could just sell her, but uh, she actually, uh, I got her because I really like her dress. Good dress. So I'm not going to sit there, put every one of you back in a bag. They're bagged up kind of weirdly. So I did hit Barbies really hard because Barbies are kind of fun to play with and you can sell them. And I finally started listing the stuff that is on my, that I got. Uh, oh, wait, wait. Mike says something real quick. Let me check this out. I binge watch Cat Million Studio. Cat, I can't say that word. Cat Million Studios doll transformation. Those dolls with big heads look much better with shrunken down. They do. They do. And I have like the jar and stuff that they use. I'm just still playing around with stuff like that. But you're right. The monster highs do look better with their normal size heads. Uh, I did get her because she was all articulated and she got her clothes on. Uh, it's just not something we always find. But she is, she's not made to move, but she is the articulated one. So that those are fun. Fun to have. And uh, what else? But yeah, I just, I kind of hit that. There was just really nothing there, but I hit the Barbies pretty hard. Uh, this is what has articulated bicycle legs, I call them, or horse riding legs so that they don't have, you know, they're kind of loose so they can move it. About. I don't know what she's wearing. I don't think she was the beekeeper. I'll have to look her up, but there's a beekeeper. She's got the jacket on. So this is, and this is what's weird. Her face paint. Hey, Sandra. Sandra's joined us and saying hi to hi, everybody. Sandra. Hey, Sandra. Good to see you. And she, uh, her face is somewhat in, in between a typical Millie paint and a Barbie paint. I'm like, you're a little bit in between faces. That's interesting. I haven't seen that before. It's cool how you know the difference. I would have to, oh, yeah. I would have to show you. A, oh, no. Drop stuff everywhere. Because you, you, you would show me something like that. It's a doll. <laughs> yeah. So we went to Texas Thrift was another one I wanted to hit, and it was not impressive. So I hit like, uh, but <coughs> things. This is, uh, I think, we'll where did I get this one? Savers or Pet Maybe Savers, actually. But anyway, this is a horse for the Playmobil. This is the bigger size. I think I have at least one bigger size Playmobil character. I thought, oh, I'll get the horse because it was cheap. I think it was like $2.49 for the bag. I don't know who this dog goes to. It says just play. Um, not didn't really buy it for the dog, but I did. I just thought, oh, I did. I did, I got some little like I do play people that tend to do pretty good uh, separately. You know, it was just a fun, fun little do. I love I love the duplos. Love Legos, but let me some duplos. 
just fun little things to get. And then I got some weird stuff too. Oh, there you are. And here's my cowboy. My dupla cowboy. But my best thing that I got, let me see if I can find her, was, oh, look, I got is We went out to eat and they, they you know, gave you like bottles. I kept my, my bottle top because um, I may need it for a pie, pit, pie plate or a dollhouse. And only Jerry would do that, right? I have these that I ordered to make pendants a yeah. few years ago. I'm gonna That's add good, this. Though. I'm gonna add this to the top of it. These little circles. I'm gonna make right. a clock. I'm gonna make a clock with it. Oh yeah. So I'm gonna print a, a print a, a clock face to put in there. I found the, I found these. This were at the pet the place that supported the pets. They're just these little boxes, and I have like a lot of miniatures and stuff. I wanted to keep safe. Seems like a good thing to do with that, or to ship small things. I uh, got a Nikki with no britches on. I think she is the mixture of whatever, but she kind of looked like the Nikki from um, the Eye Doctor. At least I'll give me an idea how to list her. Okay, but she's got articulated knees. That's the things I was kind of looking for. So I went back and forth on this doll, who I haven't taken it out of the package yet. So she's a dollar ninety nine. He said they're a little bit more expensive than what I'm used to. And if I pay like seventy five cents for a doll, yeah, or a bag full. <laughs> I think this. Well, that was look like savers, didn't it? Yeah, I believe that's a savers. One thing about savers, we don't have them around here. But if you donate stuff, you you, you get a twenty percent off your purchase coupon. Then you know right for that. Yeah. Day. So. Um, I've seen some of resellers um, go to Savers a lot. Barbie, but if those are your earrings. She has a couple of places that need cleaning up and needs a new elastic. But this doll, whose face, um, I'm being weird so I can get you closer. That's the Mackie face. I looked her up and she was selling for good, for good money for like a lot more than $2, we'll just say. And so I'm going to take a chance on her. This is gambling. This is like a Gambler's Anonymous kind of, I need to go to, because it's like, I'm going to <laughs> invest $1.99 in this if she scores big, but not not like real gambling. No. Well, so, that's what resellers do Yeah. on YouTube. They, they buy something and, and, and take a chance on it. That, that'll make them big money. Yeah, and it's happened. Yeah. I've done it. Girl, I, I did it. I have, done, I have done it many times on me. But this is uh, Robin Wright's character. I think she has a haircut and a very bad one, like a really bad one. But uh, the body is one of those really cool ones that I like to use with my... Um, they're the same ones that come on those little superhero dolls that I like to paint. And they have bigger heads, though. But anyway, I, 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 I don't know. I don't know. I like because I love her body. Her face is like she's not a happy camper. She got a she got a sad face on. So but I made that was the nine bucks. End up selling. Oh, uh, and I love her. Thousand more to go. There's yeah, nine you did great. Look at that. Just a thousand thousand more to go. Uh, just a thousand. No big deal. I did like this one with the vitiligo, and I was really uh, surprised how many they made of the care the people who have this condition. Because I'm you know I'm not people who have it and. Um, but that was just, I was looking at her after find out her name. I'm like, oh, they made like several of these. So there is that. And she's really, she came with her all clothes and all that stuff complete. So I'm not going to have you guys watch me make thousands of books today. So I, I'm going to put them in the top row here for now. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Let's see how they look. Um, <laughs> On my on the bookcase that came with the stuff that I bought, I put it in my dollhouse, and it's the wrong. It's too long for the wall where I wanted to put it. So I'm gonna have to build my own stuff, my own bookcases too. But and the other thing with the one that I bought is they're all the same size, and I kind of want the look of them being you know, the shelves being different. I don't know what happened to this doll's hair, but she is like missing. Oh yeah, somebody cut chunk. She came in a bag with some other dolls, but she does have boots. So I'm excited about that. But yeah, that's more for the boots. But she just came in with a bag. But her hair is cut. So I I repainted Elsa. Let me repaint one of these too, apparently. What, yeah. Once I, I get all the books done, then I'll glue them down so they won't keep on falling down. But for now. Yeah. 
So JoJo here is missing her. Her voice is not, her batteries are dead, but JoJo got another weird doll that I don't know. Like I said, these three came in back with another doll. So I like the other doll. There you go. Uh, yay. They, they see, they really look good. All the separate, it's worth it. It's worth the effort, I think. Yeah. Okay. So Liz, so Liz this is nine, out on us for a minute. This is nine, so I probably need to get seven more. So fifteen yeah, books per per shelf. Yeah, but if you've got a library, a lot of shelves are not full, and like, I know other stuff in there. Uh, this is a Moxie Girl, I think they call them. Yeah, with the with the I, 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 I have two, some extra three, shoes five. for these kind of dolls. Mm -hmm. She needs her hair washed. It's kind of got the frizz going, but I think that's her original outfit. So I've got one of that. Two ninety nine dollars though. I'm like, ah, oh, well. That was fun. But I did get some other cool, just a couple other cool things I got. I need to make 255 books. Oh, not too bad. Me. I thought I was going to be making 1000 <laughs> Yeah. So I got a chair that is missing some spinnable. I think that's going to be the size of a skewer. I just took it. I said, yeah, I bet that a skewer is going to, yeah, I can fix that. I ordered these um, little lights on Amazon. Yeah, yeah. We got to talk about those lights. They, they come. I, I ordered a small pack because I wasn't sure, you know, if I was going to keep on doing lights or, or whatever. Mm -hmm. It came with six lights and three battery packs. Nice. So you can move, you know, put them on different so sides of the house. Yeah. So but you I can build, did. Light, build your lights out of that. I did a little willow tree thing I need to take out to my lake house. So I, I'm putting the desk towards this back wall and I built these sort of fake columns out of, uh -huh. to put on either side of it. Uh huh. Right. And then drill the hole for, I'm not sure what to use for the light fixture itself. But we're going to drill a hole and then glue these on. It'll keep you busy for a while. Yes, it will. Mike, you said that's going to keep you busy for a while, Nancy. So there. Yes. A little bit. No, it's actually, she's been, now this is a very efficient way of doing it. So I think it's going to be great. Always looking for right, miniatures. I, 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 I found this wonderful fireplace. It's not something, I don't think I'm going to use it. I paid five for it, but like I said, this was a pet one. I looked these up. These things are selling for lots of money. I don't know why this particular brand uh, does, but they're really beautiful and detailed. I know you can't really see much. So I'm going to list this on eBay for now to see what happens. One second. Monkey, come here. Now, I, I grabbed this bag because it was like one of the half price things. It's just full of cool yarn. And little, because it, uh, it's somewhere in my fantasies, I think I'm going to make a rug out of it. Yeah, somewhere. My fantasy world. And I got a yes. little chair. I got the big chair like it, which I need for my Santas that sit down. And I paid some dollars for that, which goes right with big dolls and Santas. And then I have to that you have to come back on July 7th on the organization video and see what, what I did with this bit right here. I used this one and three eighths bit, whole bit. Mm -hmm. Okay. So oh, really? Oh, I did grab some wooden beads from the pet store, the pet place, because I keep finding these for wooden beads with miniatures and these colored beads because they're just so fun to make little bottles out of so I'll grab some of those and these lights are only an eighth of an inch wide you don't need a big hole so let me get a drill bit real quick so anyway that was pretty good now here's my big thing i gotta show y'all so years ago, I got this from my son, and he never really did anything with these. And I said, okay, it was at one time, and I said, okay, I need them back because let me let me play with them for a little bit to see if I like them. Now, I, I've been looking up uh, one 12th scale ball jointed dolls, and they just don't, I mean, they make them and they're very expensive. So I knew there was an alternative to this. And this is a mo an artist model, and what you do with these is they have a stand that goes with them and you can pose them and essentially this is what you do with them and then you can photograph them 
uh, post them in different poses because they're seriously articulated. Let me get a stand on really look, good. Look at that. Look at over here. You have one? No, that one's wooden, right? Yeah, I have a little wooden one. Yeah, the little wooden guy too. And, and But this guy is like some serious realism. Wow. So, oh, yeah. He's All the muscles on that. Crazy. Plus, how tall is that one? And this one is more in scale. Anyway, he's got yeah, this, this guy, neck that's this not small. Really possible. But these are really cool. And so what you do is you light them, you photograph them. And in theory, you use them as like one of the layers. You take your images and use them as a layer towards your uh, creating these characters on the, on your um He's Compared five foot tall. <laughs> so he's this five is five inches. Five, he's how tall? <clears throat> five inches. So really? I, I think, I think yeah, so five, he, this five is five foot compared tall. to my five foot nine man. So he's not even very tall. He would well, be about, I think. He's, he's my about, size. Yeah, he's I'm, about I'm, five five in real life. So he's actually pretty small. So he's not really true one six scale. But some of my doll stuff is really small. And I was wondering. They make two different women. One is a very, well, they make two different couples. What I'm saying, they have the very um, uh, anime with the really big heads and uh, other big items on their bodies. So mm -hmm. she is got, uh, I like it because she kind of looks like she has a top on. So she's got that going for her. So this is the female of the, the pair. And she's got like the super long, like, like a Barbie. So she's really a lot smaller than my typical dolls. I mean, a lot smaller. I am kind of curious to see how she will look with some of my smaller scale uh, furniture and stuff like that. I think it would be interesting. So I, I borrowed these back from him to play with. I might use him in mine because I am five foot tall. Mm -hmm. There you go. No, that one makes you I have me. one. Where's my little one? Yeah, I don't know where I keep my little guy. I have my big one somewhere too, but I have the little one too. So yeah, those little wooden people, not a bad idea. Just saying. So now that this has had a little bit of chance to set, let's see what we got going here, woman. You need more time for your hair to set, maybe. I can put some more hair on her. While we're sitting here, take a break. I'm going to get this whole party part straightened out first mike wanted to know if that was silver surfer i know it does look like that doesn't it uh those things come in gray and they come in uh flesh and like an orange oh i said they'll call it flesh i forgot what they call it tan bright beige and they also come in orange orangey weird color but the gray is actually better for photography you get some really good shadows oh man did you just get hair Places you don't want her to be. Let me test these lights out. You know, just gonna be a little problem, child. Oh, it's perfect. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna I'm glue these on the to the wall and then redrill where the where the holes are because I want the lights coming from the back of the of the outside the, the building. Mm -hmm. So let me glue these on. And what I did with these was um got the the one eighth sh sheet of basswood. I'm here showing the camera. One eight inch sheet of basswood, basswood, and cut it the the width of it, and then I got my quarter inch square dowels. Hold on, these guys, and made a frame around it. So, because I was gonna put a light uh, bookcases here, but then I said oh, it, I, if I do this, it looks like a uh, a faux um column. Oh, cool. Hi, Herb. Okay. Thank you, Elia. In Austin, let's go do a little uh, off-roading in this area. It was beautiful up in the hill country. Beautiful area. I have no idea where we were. Nobody tells me anything. I just I sit in the back seat. Can't see a thing. But we mm -hmm. went, and the, it's so much fun. But the thing is, it is my neck and body. I feel it today. I am so sore from being tossed around. It, it's just what Jeeps are for. We have my son drives a Jeep as well. So we're Jeep, Jeepers. Jeepers creepers. Oh, my son and I have a game. Because mm -hmm. uh, dri driving to um, Miami for testing, you know, takes a while. Mm -hmm. So w w instead of um, punch buggy. Yeah. We scream Jeep. Yep. 
but it's only for the Wranglers. We don't do any other Jeep. Oh, right, right. Because the Wranglers are easy to spot. Oh, we always say, yeah, we always acknowledge Jeeps. Yep. I know. Okay. He, so he has fun see. because he can, he can spot them faster. Mm -hmm. Plus, I'm driving, so um, hello. <laughs> I can't see them as fast as you can. That's fun. Yeah, we did that. That's we've had. Okay, but I want to tell y'all something, and that some people may argue with me on this, but I want to tell you what I know about Jeeps and about I'm sore. Okay, <laughs> I'm doing this, and we were on. We were in a Jeep, and we were doing some threes. Which, if you know how they scale, it's like fours and fives. We do not do because you have to have the special vehicles for those, or you have to have really big lift kits, or you have to have all this stuff. So it's all that kind of stuff. All right. So we were sticking to like threes and under, and we come up to this. These people who are in these little. Oh my gosh, where's your other arm? Who are in a. Uh, the fun things, the little uh, off-roading vehicles, the yeah, I can't think the of it. Polaris, you know, the, the mules, things like that. So they're in yeah. that, and they have a child in a car seat who is probably what? two to three. When we owned a Jeep, I, when our children were little, like baby, I said we're selling the Jeep for a while. We sold the Jeep we had for a while. I said, we're just going to can't do Jeeps for a while because they are very rough just to ride in a vehicle with. They're very bouncy. I mean, they're, you will get, you will give your child shaken child syndrome in the back doing that. Okay. Oh, no. It happens. It is a real thing. I am telling you. And I was in shock and I said, I just really kind of want to talk to this person and say, what you're doing is really stupid. You should not have a child because their little bodies are only a percentage the huge bodies, little bit, you know, huge heads, little bitty bodies, and their necks are tiny. And they will, my neck hurts today. I mean, I'm sore. Can you imagine what that child went through? He could have snapped his neck. He could have literally created a shaken child syndrome. Um, and it's a thing. Yeah. Let your, let your kid in the back of a really bumpy vehicle and something like that. So if you're guilty of having ever done that, uh, don't do it again. But that's my that's my soapbox for the day. But my husband was like, well, let's just, you know, he didn't have to ride in it. And I said, but then it's just kind of there. It's in our way. It's, the, it's just that other vehicle. And this was an off-roading. I mean, this, this Jeep was not a fancy Jeep. It was for playing in. I said, we can take a break from Jeep for a little while and grow. Let's be grown-ups just for a little while. Let's try to be grown-ups. And then we can be kids again. So that's my thing, if you want to know my opinion. Oh, I, yeah, I got my share of stupid people while I was in Austin. Just say, if you're from Austin, you're a stupid person. Just die like, <laughs> like. Well, I don't know. There's plenty of them. Don't they call Austin like a, the weird place or something? Something with weird? Austin is a little bit weird, but it's, it's it, well, <laughs> it's a very liberal city, but that's not, though it's weird. It's just weird. <laughs> we'll leave it at that. Liz is back. But yeah, I just gotta appreciate. Well, while well, those columns are drying up, um, the glue before I could. Hey, Larry's here. Hey, Larry. Hello. Thank you for joining us. Good see. Uh, hi. Uh, oh man, I unplugged my glue gun, and I need it. That's on Herb, not Larry. Oh, I'm sorry. You think well, what's his name good? though? It's not Herb. Is this name? Is Herb. I'm confused again. See, I get those two confused. You, 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 the other one is, uh, is, Henry, is Henry. Henry. Yeah, don't even. I it's get Henry. I'm not aphasia. Not happening here. Henry is uh, the one I called. This Mary. Henry's, yeah, Henry's the wood thing. Okay, well that's dry. I have Thank a, you for that question. clarification. Because there's not. Yes. What do you have? Picture window, right? Yes. I got two pictures. I see if you guys pick the same one I take. I got this one. I'm gonna do a frame around it and, and it, to make it look like a window. So we got that one. Or this yeah, one. Oh, yeah, I'm back. So you got the 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 fall or the lake. I like the I like the fall colors personally. That's what I was going for. Mm -hmm. What do y'all think? Fall or, or the uh, other one? So it's going to be a big Based one. Basically on two phones. I, I'm here now. Robin's helping try and get my little video. Yay. For, oh, she's so good for that. Yeah. Good job. Well, all right. What's this video? For? We have a video, dude. When does the, when does the, um, 
the, the organizing. July 7th? Mm hmm So next yeah. Thursday. That's my next project next today. Thursday, next Thursday. So I'm going to yeah. be using the quarter-inch dowels and stuff to make a frame around the window. Yes. I'm put a piece of, um, um, what you call it? I have, um, uh, what is it called? It's um transparency sheets. Oh, nice shirt, girl! What? I love this shirt. You're rocking that one. <gasps> so awesome. That's my one of my my presents from my husband. I love it. Tell him good job. That looks great. I have these um these uh oh this is the wrong wrong box. Uh, it's up there. I have a box of transparency sheets that I got from Salvation Army. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put that in front of the picture so it can look like glass. Oh, good, good, good. I, and then I, I'm going to have some panes going through it as well to make, to make it more look like a, a window. Yeah, oh, I still have no glue. Oh, I'm you want to see what else he got me? Hang on a second. I'm going to let you do this while I go find some glue. Oh, wrong one. Hi, everybody. Look what else he got me. He got me the Mandalorian. I mean, Grogu. Oh, no, I, got stick. Oh, not this one, I got the the diamond painting with Grogu. Let me say that. Oh, too precious. I still got. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. I still got to make my doll that I want to make my Mandalorian doll. I mean, my uh, Grogu doll. I have all this stuff. I just gotta make it. Just okay. time. Okay, I'm gonna drill the hole through the through the the fake column. Mm-hmm. Wow, I cannot get my glue to work at all. I'm really getting frustrated. I did plug it in, yeah. So now we're going to go through the back. Don't mind the back, it's ugly. I'll cover it up if I, if I feel like it. <laughs> no. I got popsicle sticks holding it together. If I feel like it. If I feel like it. Because it's going to be on the bookshelf, so. Mm-hmm. Oh, we're going to no, just... Don't break, don't break, don't break, don't break. I may have put a too strong of a wire on my baby. Oh, okay. I need to... It, the light fits, but the little... You see there? There's a little tag on the bottom of the light. Mm-hmm. It's a little wider than the light, so I'm going to... I'm going to bore this a little bit on the back here. Well... I am so not a city or suburb person. I, I, I don't I don't get into the whole just I couldn't live there. Just cannot live like that. <laughs> I know. It's I don't know. It's just too much stuff. Get a little Oh my gosh, y'all you know I just have and I'm not gonna say it right, it's like jurophobia or whatever. I don't like bridges. Oh my gosh, the overpasses in that area. The sky what they call fly flight passes or something? I don't know, they have some weird name. Yes, because they're so high. I'm like, why do you have to be up so high? Why? It's scary up here. I don't like that. I don't like it. Okay. Something's up here. Hold on. It wasn't dry and it moved. At the bottom. Oh, really? So I'm going to do this for a second. Not laid on the side. I heard my little armies on the you can see the flooring I, that, that I, I finished, that I yeah. stained last week. I'm putting up my little arms on my baby. There we go. Um, oh, and that glue did not hold. You know what, what? What's good for weights on these things? Hmm. The battery from your from your uh, machines. Oh yeah, they're heavy enough to to sit them down there. Good job. Who knew? Because that that one moves. So I'm I'm gonna let it sit for a few seconds more because it's. It wasn't completely dry when I started drilling. Oh, what did I do? Did I do something wrong? No, okay. There we go. What else did I, Oh, 
while, while that that's I'm drying up real quick, I, I started the the wall that I'm gonna put on the outside of the library. It's gonna uh -huh. be like a door. So pretend this is the right side of the of, of the library. So I'm I made this to look like a, a row of books. Yeah, I do. I isn't that amazing, y'all? I'm gonna get her on big screen for this. Opening up to, to the library. I love this so much. I think she did a I did, really I did good the job. green one already. It's so gorgeous. Gonna it. Are you gonna do like any kind of? Because I know you have like all the stickers and things that you could actually label your books and give them titles and stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna, gonna put tit I'm gonna put titles. Mm -hmm. So I just did um this right here under the the brown paper bag is actually um macrame cord hey you know what that you know what those stripes are for right no <laughs> oh you don't that's book binding that's where the book is sewn together oh okay mm -hmm. that's why they they kind of you have them even but then a couple of them they're not even they would be even because okay. that's where they sew the old books together but now we use glue and stuff like that we won't do it the same way but yeah that's back in the day when they bound they sewed the books together Oh, so I'm working on my little doll here, my little baby. And instead I learned something of the thing, here today. So the doll had string, and the string was like really uh, sticking out, uh, elastic, like a big old knot. And I said, I don't want it to look like that. I want to be a little more trim. I'm just putting some wire inside, a little bit of wire like this to create my. I know I need to be on a big screen. Sorry, guys. Go ahead. We'll split it for a little bit. So there's that, um, gluing that in to my buddy. I'm waiting for this to dry a little bit before I start moving it again. That's what happens when you're not patient. You start moving things when it's not dry. Everything moves. You don't want that. Mm -hmm. Make sure my little desk still fits in here. Yep. Okay. So I, I made the, the, the columns to, to fit on either side of the desk. So I just hot glued it onto the, so the, to the so I did, I'm not using this part because I don't want that hole. I don't want things sticking out. And then there's different ways you could do this. I Hi, just Kathleen. feel this is going to work for me. Thank you for coming, Kathleen. Are you leaving us? Thank you for coming. No, she, she just, oh, she just joined us. Oh, hi, Kathleen. Oh, <laughs> she is. Hi, good to see you. Great. This one moved. Big time. Definitely wait till it dries, people. Legs straight. So let's poke the lights through the back and then connect the battery packs. Wait a minute. I need batteries. <laughs> Um, As you take the battery right now, you need the battery. Where's okay? It's it's, it's what? Triple A. I got a couple in here. That's a little touch up to do on his foot because I just noticed your foot, your little feet. Oh, well, you have little booties or something on. But I will paint his feet because I'm weird that way. I just got to have the feet painted. I need one more light, one more battery. Actually, I can do I can do both from the same pack. Because they're, they're, they're on the same wall. So we're going to put batteries. In my tips to stay organized. I just got disorganized. Where did you go? I lost my end. Okay. I have to, let's see, expose the, the wire from both ends because they're not exposed. You would think they would keep, make them exposed and make it easier for you. Jeez, people. Now I gotta figure out how to. Are you trying about your, your lighting? Yes, we're gonna talk about lighting now. We're gonna get that lighting yeah. done. Yay. Yeah, because I said, I was, we were talked about this maybe in a show, maybe we did backstage, I can't remember. But I was like, certainly yeah. somebody makes like wiring kits that you can build your own, on your own lighting, tech, you know, kind of thing mm -hmm. for small houses. And she found it. I want my little baby to be naked. Well, that's not the right kind of diaper for your period, but we'll deal with it. Hi, Cindy. 
No, I'm in. Hey, Cindy, good to see you. Good to see you. Hey, yeah, I'm going to put a baby on my ghost baby. A diaper on my ghost baby. Me as well. I'm, I'm doing this the wrong way because I don't have a tool to, to strip the wire. Ugh, it's not working. Really? You had, to, you had to do fancy stuff like that? You don't have a wire stripper? No. I know what you mean, though, because it's hard that you will totally wreck it in a heartbeat because those are some thin wires to work with. And that is one of the reasons I haven't really gotten into wire lighting my house. It's, it is a thing. It's just all this little picky, tiny wires that you get. Very tiny wires to work with. My husband helped me here again. Mm -hmm. He gave me my wire cutter and told me not to press all the way. Well, yeah. But they're even smaller than just any kind of wires you most yes, people are used to working with. Yeah, I know. Glenda from Australia. Hello. Yeah, there. Mm -hmm. Okay. So mm -hmm. now I've got my baby and my baby is ready for some clothes, which should not be hard. Back to sense. the hair. So we're back to the hair on the um, mom's hair starting to set. So I'm going to give her a little bit more hair. I'm doing this in stages because I want the hair to start drying. This is like the worst color red. It is so pink. I don't like it. I'm, hang on, let me see what else I got. Oh, that's too hard. Even pinker. My reds are too pink. It's hot in my house. I also have this. My bright orange, which I use on most of my clowns, is something a little bit darker orangey. Red, which is kind of not bad. I mean, it's just a little bit different, but not enough to go there. She's going to have some hot. She, it's looking, because there's not much of it, it's looking really pink. I'm kind of worried about its pinkiness. You're really pink, honey. You don't put much hair on them because their heads are so small. She does need a little bit more. Give her a bouffant. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Well, that was my thing is how nicely do we want her hair to look because you know when we buried her i'm sure she's she is kind of ghostly i like her hair kind of going every which way too and i'm going to come in with some white by the way this glue smells so bad did not know that buying it obviously that it does have a very strong odor so if you use this glue you know that odor after I used it one day a lot i was like everything i tasted everything i ate was like smelling and tasting like this glue so we're going to do get one side of the wires to connect it to the red wire. Uh, lower you down a second. There you go. So you can see me. And we're going to hide this comment. There we go. I'm sorry about that. No problem. I'm the worst about forgetting to hide them. <laughs> I'm getting two. Okay. Two to connect to the black. I'm doing this before I slide it in because that way I, I know the lights work. Mm -hmm. I don't want to go through all that and then the lights don't work. On a regular doll, I, I'd recommend you paint their hair, uh, their head, the color of the hair that you're going to use so that it would show up better. I mean, her, she's got blonde hair, so it showed up on a on a buff color anyway. Mm -hmm. On her um, this color, so I'm gonna put some electrical tape on. Kathleen wants to know what glue are you using? I am using a uh, Fab Fabric Tac, and it's it is a good glue, but boy, it smells strong. Mine didn't have a smell. Whoop. Makes it wrong with mine. Hmm. I don't know. Cindy, go, Cindy goes freezing in my studio. Permanent fabric Larry is here now. Now you can say Larry. Yes. Okay, now I got the names right. There you go. Howdy. Hello, Larry. Now I can say hi to you. Cindy says that they keep her um her office cold. Hi. 
I didn't call you. I said Larry. Is your name Larry? Larry. My son comes. He goes, yes, mommy. And I go, I didn't call you. Yeah. I called Larry. I said Larry. Let's see if Nancy knows what she's doing with this wiring. Yes, you definitely need to let the be- the hair dry overnight before you start like trying to decorate it. Cause I tried that before, tried to style her hair before it was dry. Oh man, it was a it was a mess. My other doll, she just it was coming off too easily. Yeah, th- that's that's what people don't understand that that, that when we, they watch videos, mm-hmm. we put twenty eight minutes of video, and it's um hours of work. Yes. I had someone say, why do you speed up your videos? And I'm uh, like, well, yeah, well you, and I did my, my, nor- I did the scene where I was painting how slow I actually paint. And it's like, it's horrible to watch. And that was actual speed. I'm not kidding you. I don't think that way. I just, it's like I'm People bad. don't understand. You don't want to watch an eight hour video. Uh-uh. I'm like, are you going to think I'm not pa- actually painting this? If I don't show you, I painted it. I'm just wondering. I could just do the snap. Ta da! Painted. Somebody painted it. Like everybody does. Yeah. <laughs> they snapped their fingers and, and the project's do done. Well, I wish that's all I had to do. If I could just blink and make it so. I wish that I could paint that fast sometimes. Mm-hmm. Okay, one of the wires is loose on the on the negative side. So let me go back and get it. I can't believe you're doing this. I'm so I'm so like I can't believe you're doing this live because I would be so messing this up right now. <laughs> doing the um trying to you know why or something but if, if it was it. more complicated i don't think i, I would be doing it <laughs> i see something this one and this one only one is lighting mm-hmm. which one's lighting I may have to switch out one. Yeah, I think some of those little necklaces that you can get, you know, that light up. I thought, oh, I, can, I wonder if I can repurpose these lights. My husband's like, look at that wiring going. Absolutely not. I had, you know, this wiring's way too small. I was like, okay, we have a problem because I have all this doll lighting that's that small. So what am I going to do? Okay, I'm going to get another one because that, that one was not. Let's see. What I've seen is what that what, before you tie it together, mm-hmm. you touch the wires to the negative and positive, and then right to see if it's working before you get all yeah. before I I um, tie it all up and mm-hmm. tape it. Here we go. I am no professional. I'm no electrician. So don't say Nancy told me to do this. I would go, go and find people that actually know what they're doing. But I'm just going by. I'm glad you're trying, though. That's what's awesome is that you're trying. Okay, why is this not working? I'm going to get a brown. And I have a nice chocolatey brown that's got a little bit of a red to it. Let me see what I got. I'm assuming you could put two two lights on one battery pack since it gave me three battery packs and six lights. Mm-hmm. So, let's see. That's a pretty dark brown. Okay, this one doesn't work either. That's really dark brown. Well, that's pretty much the same hair, hair color, isn't it? Yeah, mm-hmm. it is. That brown. But where's this? One? I like a whole bunch of browns. Look, it lights. Oh yay! Yeah. You did it. I did it. Now I'm gonna add the other other light to it. Not this red, but this red to me is once again just so. Oh, I don't know. I'm gonna use that. I'll try it. And some browns. I'm just going to mix in some other colors to our hair to kind of keep it from being so much. I was trying I to find the red for a leprechaun color. If I can find it. I think I ended up with all those other weird colors. Instead. I know the basic of electrical, you know, <laughs> the brown is black. But I've never added lights to anything, so. 
that's why I was a little, a little iffy about it. But I, I know the basics. Yeah, I'm just kind of lighting on the refs for this. They're both lighting. Yeah, Sorry. you did it. Now we'll put some electric, electrical tape. Oh, you know what I need to do now? Because I'm getting hair all in. I just need to put me a glob of glue down and use that to instead of. <laughs> and get on the dog. Because every time I do that, I get hair. In my now I gotta figure out, go through my through my stuff and see if I can find something to make a like a sconce or something mm -hmm. for the light. I might put some some light in the bookshelves to, to light up a, a piece of artwork or something. Like yeah. over the center where the butterfly is. Some of the hair I'm pulling off is kind of straight on this, this particular felt they have bigger kits of lights but i only got the one with six lights because mm -hmm. like my, my library wasn't that big to have you know more than that right if i put all six lights up and now they may they're very expensive it's a shame because i just don't see why they're that expensive but they do make the little led lights with the batteries and they're like 20 bucks and up and i'm just like why are they so expensive I just don't get it because, you know, you can buy a bazillion little candles that are LED and a battery. Why am I picking that up? I don't use that. I got this one. Um, I think it was, I could, I could tell you how much I, I paid for this one. If anybody wants a lot, you buy a lot of your kit, the kit. I'm making my little wefts right now. I wish I had more scissors handy because I'm going to make a mess. I'm just getting the this glue and dabbing it on the end. This six pack was, was, what is it? I know, she's looking so creepy. Oh, that's 880. The six pack was 880. Yeah. Okay. And that was with shipping or? Yeah, with shipping. Cause what I, what I do, cause I don't have Amazon Prime, mm -hmm. but they, they do have Amazon lockers that you can send your stuff to. Mm -hmm. And when you have enough stuff, no, um, they don't tell you that if you use the Amazon locker, it's also free. You, you just don't get it two days. Oh, okay. So, so I said they just wait. And, oh, I see. They're just waiting until you have enough stuff to ship. And no, no. Wow, that's weird. Okay. Yeah. I did not know about this. The things we learn. I didn't know about it either. But when when you when you go to check out, because mm -hmm. I I picked the, the the locker because you know the thing with the printer that I, that happened with me, that the Amazon keep kept on right. Me. So I do I send it to the locker if I if I'm able to, but the mm -hmm. locker won't accept the big packages. So um, when I'm able to, I, I send it to the locker. Okay, and when you go check out, it, it tells you you can get sent into the locker for for free, but it, it'll take you two extra days. I mean, like, right. okay. Oh yeah, if you're not in a hurry. Absolutely. I still had to. Hmm. That little plastic piece in the back is behind the light is a little too big. Still, I mean, too small. The whole. Did you see the pictures I posted in the Instagram chat of my of my dad's um trains on town? No. I haven't been now. I haven't done a lot of Instagram since I got back. I was so busy. So yeah, I had to check it out. And we think we think that you know one in twenty four, one in in, in oh, six. Oh yeah. But the the what he has is, is I think he said one in eighty four. Oh my gosh! It's the the H O size. Yes, it's so tiny. Mm hmm. 
So when I was taking a picture of, of a house that he had on the corner of it, and when I zoomed in, I go, there's a person on the steps. Oh my gosh. I couldn't see it with my naked eye. I had to zoom in. That just, that I will say the people who make that tiny, that's so impressed. Cause that's some crazy. Crazy small. But he, he's having fun with it. Yeah. For a couple years that he had stopped um working on them. But he, he went back to it and I was like, it keeps them busy. They're great. Does anybody know? Hey, Lola says, okay, peeps, it's not good. Okay. Oh, no. It's not good, but it's my first one. It took me forever to edit. You must forget all the ums. It would be so kind. Oh, we will. Yeah. Um. Oh, you missed so much. Hey, uh, well, yeah, I can share your channel. Hang on a sec. Uh -oh. I'm still adding all different shades of hair, kind of blending all this stuff in. That's weird. Lola, just paste the link you sent me. I don't, yeah, I don't know if it'll come through, but let me get to um, look and find. This board on this side just, just didn't glue at all. Look. What happened? No, it didn't glue. You know why it didn't glue? Why? You use the wrong glue. Using my podge. No. Not one glue. I grabbed the wrong bottle. That makes a difference. Mm-hmm. Oh, I had to put my filters on. Channel. And I can put that one back on. Oh, where did they just do that? A tree mm -hmm. and white videos. Let me see what's the most recent video. I, I did that at one time with, with the little a lantern. Hi there. Right? This is Lola with all right, we're trying. Don't let me shut anything out. There we go. There's Lola's link. Now I'll have to catch it later. Okay. I'm going to have to redrill that hole because it, it probably came down when I... Let's see. Stick a little pencil in there. No, that's too short. Um, do, 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 uh, a skewer. That'll make me. You know if it's all the way through. Uh, this chick has got some weird hair. It is so dark. <coughs> I wanted my, them to have red hair because I thought it would just really pop. <laughs> this is some crazy red I got going. Yeah. That one. Okay, stay. Okay, I'm, I'm going to let you stay for a second. Dry up. Be good. And I'll work on your buddy over here. I'm going to put some glue on the ends and kind of create that little way. I'm going to just cut it, trim it back. And then it stuck to my finger instead of the doll. Great. Hmm. Come on. I, I know I made that hole big enough. Let's see. Oh, it's going to need some more glue. I just I think I cut all my good glue off. No, I didn't make it big enough. Uh, why are you so far apart? Huh? Why did we get rid of that one? Sorry. Do it again. Why are you so far apart? Who, who, who's she talking about? Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm here drilling. You guys don't see, can't see what I'm doing. There you go. Okay. Yeah, I didn't even mess with my my speaker problems. I was just like a freak. That's how they start out, and then 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 you can tighten it, tidy it up. Need to get a little bit more red. Jeez. If I did this strawberry or ah, oh, that light red is so pink. Hey. 
Thanks, Nancy, for what? <laughs> oh, I posted it. Who said that? Robin. Who said that? Oh, Robin. Robin, I, I don't. Kathleen goes, they live in different states. Hey, I don't know what that. I just. Oh, she says, I hear you. I hear y'all on Nancy's channel. And then three minutes later, I hear y'all. Oh, Jenny's you need to channel. refresh. Um, yeah. Just refresh your other channel. It's just, it's just got behind. That's why. Or, or well, check, I'm check, something, the, yeah. check the live button and make sure that it's red. Mm -hmm. But sometimes um, it falls behind and it's not live. Yeah. This is why a lot of people use yarn for hair is because it's so hard to get a really good color on the natural um on the stuff that i use a good especially a good red i don't know why they can't do a good red Hardy weirdest shorts that I like to watch. And one of them is the girl who does who shears the um shears the everything. She shears everything, llamas, lambs, you know, you name it, she shears mm -hmm. it. And alpacas, all that good stuff. And so she uh just I love just watch that video, those videos. I just dropped glue on my on my pants and it's dry. And look at it. I got a white spot. I mean a dark spot on my pants on my shorts. Oh, well. That's terrible. That's a crafter's life. It is. So many of my clothes covered with if, if, if you don't, If you don't want to mess it up, don't wear it. Yeah, I can just walk into my studio in something and it will get stuff on it. <laughs> well, I still want to play with it, but I'm not supposed to until it dries. So set you aside. You've got other projects to work on. I don't know, like a child. Let's start working on one of the children. There's like my glee mess down here. Here goes my second light. Oh, but I did go to a, uh, a store and I don't know where that video is. I've got to find my video where I, it was a toy store and they had like a section for you know, miniatures and dollhouses. They only had a couple of dollhouses and even those are way, way higher than Hobby Lobby, and they were the same kind. So, but they did have one dollhouse that I had not seen anywhere like for sale physically, and it was so expensive. But it was a very wonderful craftsman house, and I loved it. So, it was that. I get one of my children. My children are going to be a bit more challenging because now I have to figure out to had to cut their wires. Oh, what have I say I'm going to do a child? I may be out of wire. No, no, I got plenty. Never mind. I just got back psychiatrist. I just got back psychiatrist. Okay. I had the devil of a time sleeping. When I was on my trip, I, I, I know another thing with, with YouTube, um, like if I'm using, watching it on my phone and watching it on, on my TV or watching it on, on computer, uh -huh. all three of them are all d a different. Um, they are. They do. Yeah. So, so it's not something that you can sync, I guess, because depending on everybody's um, connection. Yeah, I'm not sure. And, and Brea, just the um, it's just the the fibromyalgia flares all night long were so much, so much fun, so much fun. And I was having a bad bout of that. Oops. All right, so I'm working on one of my children, um, and so that meant cutting. I'm using my my scale thing. That sounds funny. I'm working on one of my children. Working on my children. And I hope everything's okay, Kathleen. Yeah. Just because I'm on phone. Yeah. I had to go to see him. Yeah. 
Well, I want to tell you, I don't know what to see, who to go see now because, you know, I'm seriously having trouble with just dementia. Seriously, seriously, brain problems that are just ridiculous. Just, have, they, just, have they checked your hormone levels? Um, the medicine I, I was taking, the bupropion, it's got, that is a, a side effect is, is dementia. So I took it for, and I told the doctor from like the first few months of taking, I said, eh, I'm not liking this. I just feel weird. My brain eh, is just something is, I definitely feel this in the brain, but then just forgetting, getting like memories, you know, and Maybe like, you know, like when your kids were little and stuff like that, which was weird. And then I just having a lot of problems with all that stuff. So I don't know. So I really can't take anything. But I was reading up on it and, and discovered that this is a, oh my gosh, it's the same boots. Don't tell me I put the wrong boot on. I put the wrong boot on. This, this is not pretty in the back. But once I finish putting the other lights, um, I'll probably, you know, you know me, I'll make, make something back there. But here we go. Ready to go to the front. Here go my lights. Actually, you can't see much of the lights. Hold on. Let me let me turn off my my sun. There we go. So I have two legs. They're the same leg. I gotta go find an, another doll. There must be another doll somewhere. They're pretty bright. Leg. They are very bright. That looks good. So I guess I'm back to these legs that I have to paint. So if I do those legs, I was going to put that on the girl. I'm okay. so sorry, Kathleen. We'll keep on you in our prayers. Uh -huh. She has panic attacks over severe depression. Yeah. That, yeah. But, but the, you know, like I said, the medicines that I was taking did more damage to me than good. And what, another thing that's been happening is kind of weird. I'm like, what is this? What is going on here? Other than me just being really klutzy. I'm just seriously klutzy. And that's getting on my nerves because I have a lot of bruises from it. And I... That's the thing with, the, with medicine. That, you know, they're supposed to help you some with, with your problem. But then you have something else that, that, that you really don't want. And this and this is bad. Well, I was noticing I was getting these things on my face and getting really annoying, like this facial tick. And it was a weird one because you know how you have ticks in your eyes and I like start flying. But I had this weird one. I said it's my Elvis lip. It was because of my lips. I did this weird thing. I said, "What is going on? This this ticks I'm getting on my face, you know." And I, and then I was getting them like all over my face in different places, but the most common one was this weird one, like in my in my lip, you know, right here. And then, and you know, like I said, typical eyes, things like that. Uh, it turns out that's another side effect from Propreon. Yay! <laughs> and I'm just, I just found that out. I was like, oh, because the hands. I don't know about y'all hear me. I drop things a lot because it's like my hands spaz out, and it's so aggravating. But I like my hands are they're just spaz. It's like, why am I spazzing out? We probably on. So I yeah, I'm in a pickle, a little bit of a pickle with all that and not quite knowing what to do uh about any of that. Uh, it's not good. So much for that anxiety, because it's Oh yeah, but when we were in when we were in Austin, oh my anxiety was terrible. the the roads freaked me out. Yeah, crowds. I just it's it's just we didn't really go anywhere where there's a lot of people. Thank goodness, because I don't like crowds at all. But I, yeah, that's that's weird. That's the thing. I, I, I really don't like clouds, uh, crowds. I, I went to an FSU game when I was in um in college. Mm -hmm. I had to leave. Yeah, that was too much for me. <laughs> Is it? Like, yeah, loud noise. Oh, loud noises. Mm -mm. For somebody who talks so loud, you would think. <laughs> but uh, the traffic. I, you know, I was telling Phil. I said I just realized, and I don't. I would. I don't think I can do it anymore. I do not think I can drive in traffic like that anymore. I just don't think I can do it. I would always have pain. My poor kids. I'm like, we're gonna try to do this with mom driving, but oh, I hate traffic. <laughs> I hate, I just, I hate cities. I just do not like it. But it gets so bad, and I don't know, um, I don't know if you're having this trouble, <laughs> that you kind of do a blackout, uh, and I know that's so stupid to say, but I'm not blacking out like I can't see. I'm blacking out like there is not a thought going through my head. I can't make a decision. I can't, 
I, and I'm telling you, like I'm going to say, I'm not functioning. That is not functioning, especially if you're driving and you're like, dunk. And it's like everything stops and you have no idea what to do. So that's kind of got that kind of got me over the weekend just the real the reality that i'm really having trouble with the the you know highways my you know the anxiety being on those really tall um i'm just gonna I um, drive and do it yeah i'm gluing okay. the little books together because i'm just gonna just glue them into the um, bookcase because they already fell out three times <laughs> oh, oh i know now get the sticky tack stuff you know get that stuff that way you don't you don't do any that wax. It does leave a little film, I admit, but it doesn't like tear it up. So it's not it's not you know and they what is it? That's not an what they would consider an irrational fear because there's are reasons to be have anxiety about driving in traffic when you're not used to driving in traffic. You live in a town mm -hmm. where when the kids get out of school, it, that's our traffic. And that unbelievable. You put the feet on the wrong. I'm just, I can't talk into this, y'all. I put the legs on the wrong legs. All right. Nope, I did. Totally did that. No, nope, wait. Um, yep. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, I did. Wrong, wrong bodies. Wrong body parts. So I would call that an irrational fear. But when it's something where you can't get out and drive, you can't drive because you're so afraid of that's different. I mean, that's like, I don't know if I could ever get used to driving in a city. That's a little, just not fun to me. I don't like going to Shreveport. I don't like going to Miami. I, mean, I know Shreveport. That's the sad part. I know the town, but, but gosh, I'm, ugh. I don't know. It is hard to go to like Austin and see the beautiful hill country. And then there's just houses everywhere. Like you don't get to enjoy the world anymore. It's just people and how, and the, and their houses that are, um, you know, I don't think about overpopulation because I live in a little town. I don't think about it. It's just not in my face. Mm -hmm. Yeah. When you go to places like that and you see all the people, houses, all the houses, so many houses. And they are some kind of expensive too. Wow. I'm like, how is my child, how are my children ever supposed to buy a decent house if this is what the prices of houses are? Just crazy. Yeah. And, and, and getting back to, back to the irrational fears of, of heights and, and bridges and things that I try to you know deal with i wouldn't having to deal with that because i'm just a passenger but if i was driving you know how i would deal with that i'll probably be screaming my head off but i um i know you know i've been i've, I've done the breathing and all that but i just not having fun. i feel i don't even feel good being i mean i'm uncomfortable riding in the car it's so <laughs> much going on overwhelming so oh, how do i do that no, it's crazy. Uh, should have to do it from below. Hmm. They're bad. Okay, we have the okay. So I'm not in. I'm not a Shreveport. I'm like that's my biggest town nearby. Uh, Monroe, like I said, I know Monroe really well. So I don't know. Yes, the worst. The worst road in the world. For it's ridiculous. Okay. It is. Oh. It is just ridiculous. Make sure that your that your drill is going the right way. <laughs> oh, that is always a thing. I have to check for. But I, I always say check first, check first before you you know put it to the wood. Well, or I, I, I was I was doing it over there, so I thought I was already. Yeah. No, yeah, it's. I think it changes itself when you're not looking because it's mean. It's a little meany. Um. Um. So my last, I do take thyroid medicine. That is one of the things I take. Um, I, ha I do have to take, I'm just wondering if I didn't take, what side effects does this have? I don't want to know. I don't want to know. I just don't no. need to know. It will just be more stress to know what side effects they have. Lola says, I don't understand how people live right on top of each other and city people with, without trees. I know. 
Well, you know, even like sitting in the, in the hotel and you're walking down the hotel and you're and you can hear all you know, the voices and all inside the other hotel rooms. You know, there are people that's apartments. That's the same thing as living in one of those apartment complexes that you can just hear constantly hear people. And I'm like, that is something you grow up with. Like you just you learn to you learn to live with it kind of thing. That's what you do. But it would it is an adjustment for me because I'm not used to that. I mean, I was so much my noise. I had a lot of stuff. I mean, I have a pond, so you can imagine how loud it is and how country it is at my house because the frogs are so loud at night. They're loud as an airplane. And and the, and when when the summer when the cicadas are. Especially when you have the cicada, cicada, a whole bunch of them come out at once, and you're just like, oh my gosh, there's a load. I, I haven't, I haven't encountered cicadas, so mm -hmm. I, I, I've heard them on, on on YouTube, and when people make, you know, mm -hmm. cicadas, I'm like, oh okay. <laughs> yeah, they're they're loud, they and they're and they're piercing loud. That's so it's it just the decibels are just so bad. So how how long do they I last? Have, I have to have some trees. Understand how many people are, yeah, I do need my trees. Is, is the, the cicadas a season or, or they are year? No, they're or? seasonal. Yeah, they're summer. But there are, do you have, you have your, what is it, seven year, 14 year, 20, you know, you know they have these different ones that come out uh -huh. and do their, because uh, they're underground most of their lives, you know, and then they come out all at once. And there's like so many, and they're so loud. But that, that there is a particular cicada um, that, yeah, oh, I do. And like, if you can hear, I have tinnitus really bad, which is insane. If you want to go crazy, God, don't ever, I hope, you know, I hope no one ever gets that because it's the worst. Although every now and then I go, just if you could just hear, we were, we were, oh, we're watching a, uh, we're watching a show and the guy had, you know, winging in his ear because he had shot a gun. So they showed that like that deafening and then they hit the ring or bomb blew up or whatever. So we're watching the show and that was going on on the show. And I said, oh, there's my ear right there. He said, I can't hear it because at the same time, I said, that's what it's like. You're just, you're drowning. You're just ringing in your ear. It will make you crazy. Pretty sure that's what Van Gogh had. And that's why he just cut the dig he cut his ear off. It will make you cray cray. Yeah, it's hard. it is hard to live with that. And I have the white noise, brown noise, pink noise. You name it. When you name the color, I've got the noise. I've tried it. Oh. Wow. I think I think I've like actually played the sound of my ear, that particular pitch, and see if that if I if I negative it out or whatever, you know, what do you call it? cancel it out. Yeah, cancel it out. Horrible, horrible. I'm adding another light, so I'm I'm stripping the wire back here. Okay. And then I'm in pain. Oh my gosh, you got pain and rear ringing. You got all that going for you. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah, it's always hard to sleep mm -hmm. anywhere we're new anyway. Mm -hmm. I came home and crashed. I did. I did will say that I took a nap for sure when I got home. No, I don't. And I will say this: you don't hear until the cicadas. You don't hear until the evening. Tree frogs and all that. All they, you know, they all make their little sounds at night, more than during the day. They're just okay. checking on everybody, see where everybody is. They just do, you know, that's your job. <laughs> so my, uh, and then we, and then you have some birds. We had a mockingbird there for a while, for like between twelve and two in the morning. Decided it just had a lot to say. And it went a long time of just singing. And it was really adorable. But when you are trying to go to sleep and he's just out there and he was in a tree that's close to my bedrooms, like you know exactly what tree to be in. And <laughs> just, he's a little hard out. I'm like, you're kidding me. Like, what are you doing? We used to have a house wren. I'm like, kill that bird. Man, if that sun came up, would sit in my windowsill and just be, and they make the weirdest sounds. The little house roads just have the weirdest calls anyway. It's like a clicky, weird, buzzy, I can't even describe it. Go listen to it on, you know, one of their sounds. Plus they sing, but they also have another sound they make right there. Like, you know, I'm, you know, I'm in here trying to sleep, right? I'm like, yes, and? 
<laughs> yeah, I got things to say, and I gotta say them on your windowsill. That's the only place I can be. I don't know what that was about. Nobody wants to hear this. It's one of those things you think you get used to it, but now you get annoyed. You're so annoyed that you can't. You're just like, why are you doing that? Got a whole world out there to sing in. Why are you singing on my windowsill? Okay. It's supposed to be like farm or something. I guess. Okay, let's try this again. So earlier when my live, I was going around with the new color. This time I'm going around with this white. If you weren't watching earlier, this is some gauze that is pretty thick. And it's kind of like put on the ends of fingers and stuff like that. But it's, the, it's, a, it's a gauze that is a tube. And then my great, it was in my grandmother's stuff. And my grandmother died when I was 17. And I've had it all that all those years in a bunch of craft stuff that I had. Never used, obviously never had used for it because it's weird. And it's always a little bit stained up, but I washed it and it cleaned right up. It was just like dusty dirt. So I decided I'm gonna give this this that yarn that I was using, but it's white and I need white. And now I gotta paint the legs. So these are the pants that I made where I put, um, I have glue all over me, where I put some ap epoxy on there to part. Apoxy is the brand, it's A-P-O-X-I-E. I know what epoxy is. This is the brand, it's called Apoxy Sculpt. And I made my little boots to match. It were high heels and it wasn't what I needed. So I kind of gave them a little matching body. One. And these are the side pieces, but I'm going to cover them because I just like how this looks. These wires are like a sixteenth of an inch or less. And then you got the little wires inside. Oh my goodness, it's hard to see. And I, and I still have my left eye uh, a little fuzzy. Really? Mm hmm So the, you know, like medicines that you have to take and all that, I mean, what are the worst side effects from the medicines like that? Do you have any problems with that, with any of your stuff? I did, the, and I stopped taking it. Uh-huh. The gabapentin for my, for my neuropathy. Right. right. Was giving me um, suicidal thoughts. Yeah, there you have it. So I stopped taking it. Oh yeah, that's it. Yeah, that's um okay. We used to look what? Huh? Oh the shells. Oh yeah, I do love I do love me some um cicada shells. <laughs> I had I was I had one that was coming out of its shell, you know, coming out and I brought it in the house. I was so excited and I wanted to watch it do its thing. I sat there and I really enjoyed watching it go through its whole process. It took about two hours for it to come out of its shell, and it was so cute. And I um, just had it sitting on my arm on my sofa and it came out of his shell. It was still soft. It was kind of fluffing itself up, you know, trying. and my cat jumped up and got it. <laughs> I'm like, what, so what do they look like? I was so mad at my cat. That was so mad. I was like, cats are dang nasty evil. I don't care what you say, but you gotta love, gotta love that cat. Sitting there waiting, just like, you little monster. You, you brought a toy. I know. It was like no interest in it whatsoever until all of a sudden it just came out. It was like just completely out and it's just, it's little, you know, it's still soft. And it was like fluffing its little wings out. And that's all that took that cat was on it. My evil kitty. The funny thing about when, when I told the doctor that, she didn't know that it, that it caused that. Huh, I know. They don't care. They're just, they're, they're, uh, you got to see, if you have not seen drugs, uh, dope sick, just, you got to watch them. You got to watch that series. If you have, is it Netflix? I think it may be Hulu. It's a series. I bet it's going to be on Hulu, but it's, it's definitely worth watching. I don't want my husband to watch that, but it's like the things they don't tell you. They just don't want you to know about drugs because big pharma. But we're, that's a whole nother show. Ooh, we get started on that. Woo! Just saying. <laughs> we'll get, we get demonetized and all sorts of bad stuff. We're dig, dissing on them. 
I don't, I, I was, I, I just didn't want to read all the, the side effects or something. I wanted to try things to see, because you're, when you get where you're just in pain all the time, you want something yeah. to work. You're, you're desperate for something to work. So I said, I don't want it to be a mental thing. Like, oh, I've got to look for this. I got to look for that. But I would start noticing things happening. And I would say, okay, well, I got to read. I got to read if that's the problem. And I didn't read up on that one. I thought, because you know what people say, you go to the doctor, you go, well, you know, I'm just forgetting stuff. And I came from keys and just sit down my phone. Can never find my phone. You know, they, oh, you're just getting old. You're just getting old. That's why everything's all hurting and aching and you lost your mind. Mm -hmm. I'm like, well, guess what? I don't want to get old. I'm like, I, I'll solve that problem. I just don't want, I just won't get old. Oh my gosh. You're making me crazy. Why? Oh my goodness. Yeah. I decided like cover it. I don't know. Just, something, just being weird about. I'm trying to get this. I'm going to cut two of those. Wires together. I thought you were going to cut two. Okay. One more. Where's the, the last one? Here we go. Please work. Maybe and I just. Yeah. I'm trying to, what I'm trying to do is put it all in one battery pack. So I don't know if it, if, if it's too How much. much it battery oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If it's too much for it, too mm -hmm. much of a drain. Could yep. be. It's, it's, it's not working with three. Okay. Could ah, be. I did all that for, for that. And mm -hmm. that rewired, rewired that, does make, that would be a problem. I can see with it. That's why they send you three battery packs. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I don't have another battery. Oh, okay. I'm going to get my son to give me a battery. Jay! So I just, I do it backwards like this. And then I, I do the sleeve just to make the edges look better. Oh my, <laughs> stuck my finger. Elvis tick. Well, I, that is my, I do call that my Elvis tick. Cause it's like, I was on a list, like doing this thing. I'm like, stop snarling. <laughs> they do it. I make it. I can't make it do it. I cannot make my lip. Wait, that's the wrong size. <laughs> James. Anyway, I can see. Yeah, I can snarl. Like, can I really snarl one side? I can't snarl that side. But this is it's the other side that does it, which is weird. Give me yeah, I this, you know things that you have anyway. But the hand spasms, mm -hmm. I would not have put together with that drug. I have so many, and I have side effects forever. Up, Everything is a side effect. So you say you had some. This to me is like I would say the worst ever. Uh, you can live with the pain. You can live with the pain. Do and and just do the stuff for the anxiety that you know avoid the situations that give you anxiety. And when you are in that anxiety, you have all these things that you're supposed to breathe and you're supposed to da 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 and try to do this. Try to do that with your life. And good luck. That's all I'm saying. Because I was like, man, I am feeling this anxiety. Maybe one more. There's one on, on the desk here. It's just some creepy stuff. <laughs> My face is scaring me to death. And I am probably not the only person who doesn't like to drive in traffic where people are just scurrying in front of you. And you and you're kind of, I'm looking at my husband who's white knuckle. You know, he is driving like a crazy man. Because you you're just defensive driving yep. in these cities. And you're trying, you know, we really avoided being in the traffic too. Because God help me. I would not have not managed that at all. Yeah, we didn't go anywhere that would put us in a traffic situation. T today, in my little home, in small town of Homestead, I was going to the UPS store, right? I was making a right-hand turn. Uh -huh. And the guy next to me decided to make a right-hand turn, too. Uh -huh. But he's on the left oh, he's lane. He's on a totally different line. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So I'm turning the corner, and all of a sudden, I, I see him from the, from, from the left side of my car. Like, what, where did he come from? Yes. Dude. Probably you may be behind. We were talking about ticks a long time ago. You might check your check to see if you're caught up. So uh the ticks, the um what else? Yeah, the I just in fact I just don't sleep. Uh as insomnia is also another. But see, I'm not on it. I, I quit taking it and in, uh into this last year. And so this year has been my dealing with it. I'm just, I'm making a little thing to just kind of take up some of that extra fabric. I just think it looks nicer under their little clothes to have. It's like they have on long underwear. 
<laughs> Make sure I got my feet on the right side of the body when I do this. Like I said, I'll, I'll probably put a little uh, a panel or, or get some chipboard or something and make a, a box. I was trying to keep making these as authentic as possible, but now I'm like over it. I am so over it. Modern technology. I'm using a glue gun. No, Big Pharma is looking for problems saying, oh, look, we got we got we got all these solutions for you and you have problems. You just didn't realize you had problems. We're going to mm -hmm. give you, you know, give you problems so you'll have solutions because we made the solution for the problem before there was a problem. Y'all know, know what I'm talking about. Well, I got a, a, a take McForman and it yeah. gives me heartburn. And it what? It gives me heartburn. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, shoot. So I have to take take something for the heartburn. Mm-hmm. Okay. Jay. Oh wait, I need to make this. No, I need to do this. So it's like, do I really want you know to fix that problem with another problem? Mm-hmm. And that is the thing. What she that. She, like, uh, uh, do I want to add to my problems by taking something that I'm going to have to deal with? Because then they'll say, okay, wait, what? You've got uh, your, your stomach's upset, so let me give you this medication. And here are the side effects of that medication that you've got to deal with. So it's just not fine. It's just not fine. I'm going to have to call these I people. I think my child is getting to be tall for some reason. How are you getting to be so tall? Uh, you're supposed to be little. Mama, where'd you go? Your kids are gonna to be as tall as you. Don't no, you're doing well, good. Uh, my, my son is seven inches taller than me. Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> Comparison. Oh man, I think I have one. One of my babies is a little bit taller than me. Get your legs. I may have to send send these people a message. Cause I think I, I've gotten two dead lights. Yeah, could have. So I'm gonna. Come on, out of six, two of them? Come on. I can understand if you got you you got a big pack. Mm-hmm. But for one third of them to be off, not good. No. I'm gonna try another one here. Is it uh, for future? It's easier. Yeah, to we're like dead. Hey, somebody say hey to us or something. So if there's if there's something wrong, because I have like no messages. All right, so here she is, just basic wrap. We got now. I got to kind of combine her body around with some. That was my other piece that I cut. I knew I'd cut another piece. And so let's give her a better. There we go. She's yeah, actually that, that other light was um a dud. Boy. She's I actually got, I think she's fine this way. I, I mean check the other way. ones. Because these people gonna give me some some. I am I, when I make my dolls, I do try to make their arms a little bit longer than the most of these dolls because they always make dolls with their arms way too short. Your arms hit you about mid thigh, and these arms are like hitting people at their you know waist. So a little bit short. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Now she does have a very long arm on this side. For some reason. I'm not really liking how plump her little arm came out. I can take it, make it look smaller. Ah, me! I'm glued to it. So. It is anybody else in the chat um, going to be joining us August 13? Well, now these guys should look like so easy to make those books. Hopefully somebody at least have some fun making a little bookcase. Yeah, they're quick. And, and I'll, I'll post a link to the, the lady that, that, that did that printable. And you, you got to make sure that when you when you put them into your into your their document uh -huh. that, you, that you you put you measure it to make sure that it's the size that you want. Yes, you, you need to do that. Yeah. 
because I didn't do that the first time and it you saw my giant books or my miniature books mm -hmm. <laughs> but it, either way it's fun trial and error I, I, I don't know, it's the name of the game there we go so she got her little clothes on. Could make you more of a blonde. Did not have blonde just a minute ago. Had that orange. Yeah, so now I gotta go find another leg that's facing the right way. This I have two of the same legs. I don't know what that's about. Why did that dog come with the same legs? Oh, that's weird. I hope that's not a thing that all my dolls are gonna be like that. Is anybody out there in the world? I know, right? Wrong? We're stuck. I think we're stuck. Something's wrong. I don't know. I just want to say, somebody say, hey, because we don't know what's going on here. I don't know. But I like nobody's commenting. Mm -hmm. It could be a problem. And we're not aware of it. Or, they, or they, they're just working on other stuff. Ah. Oh, come here. That's a pretty wand. I love this, that wand. This guy down. There we go. Like I said, I'm going to fix this later. Now we're going to fix this one here. So we got this one. Now we got, let's get the black one. The red one. Because it says it has four eyes on us, but... um. Speak to us. I know. Are you guys, are you yeah, guys I, I don't know. Let me go. On, let me real quick. Let me go look on something online. Let me go look on Facebook on my phone. See if we can figure out what is going on. I don't, I don't see. I don't. I don't see any um new comments on our pages. Yeah. No. Hmm. What am I in? I'm on Facebook. I thought I was on YouTube. I'm on Facebook. I don't know what's wrong with my thing. My my thing said I wasn't signed in. Oh no, not again. Let me see. Let my me see. phone. My phone. It's being weird. I'm going to say hey on your channel, see what happens. You pop up on our side. I can't get online. I can't. I'm, I, it's, oh, there, it, it took a while for it to come by. Okay. So the chat's working. They're probably busy. Okay. But then I realized, why am I not getting in? <laughs> oh, my gosh. I can't deal with this right now. Yeah, I'm not going to find out on my thing. So it's going to be a little bit more challenging because of her already having this hairline I'm trying to work around. So I am curious to see what I can do with her. I mean, just put go out with glue. Do it that way. Huh. Okay. Let's see if this one's disconnected somehow. One, two, three. That's two. And that one goes over there. This one goes over here. Me no happy. Mm-hmm. Oh, well, at least you can say, look, I did it. You can watch me do it on my live stream. What did I do wrong? Or did you do it? Or it just doesn't work. The the ones that I that I had on earlier won't come back on. 
Oh, they won't? Oh, my gosh. So I don't know if it's... Blew it out. You blew out the circuit. Let me see. Hmm. I'm going to put it over here. For some reason, it's harder to work up and down than lying down. Let's try this again. Do one by light, one light by one light, and we go. Oof. If I get the this worked out and the stuff like that, I think I'm gonna do the library ladder next week yeah mm -hmm. yeah i'll continue making the books yeah you can just kind of do that when you're got nothing better to do lol <laughs> sorry about that i don't say you make some books okay that one's good Now you don't want to see a per person make 200 books over and over again. Okay. They're working. It's just probably the way I was trying to um, strap them together. Uh -huh. It's really hard standing up. It's not hard, people. It's just tedious. Yes, and you, and, and use, use your words. I don't know if you can see. Look how tiny those wires are. I don't know. So, I, know. I got a bunch of lights around here. I got to deal with. So you, you gotta be, be um very careful that you don't. Okay, use some more blonde hair. In the back. There we go. Where, where, where? There we go. Okay, they're both coming on again. Oh, don't fall. I want you to fall. I got a little impatient and I got a bit of water here. I'm going to regret that. Let's see if I can make a weft. question for everyone what part of the miniature stuff is exciting to you I, when it's all done and you do a video we go like oh they did they made one they actually made it work <laughs> they pulled it off yep yes being and done and enjoying it definitely high on my list and my favorite part. Oh my gosh, I've got to clean up my glue. I've got hair all over it. My my biggest thing is when when, when I finish the, the roll top desk and it works. Mm-hmm. I did it. I did it. What are you duct oh your wire? I mean not duct taping, electrical taping. Yeah, electrical tape. Mm-hmm. Well, my husband like solders and does all that. So he just loves doing that kind of stuff. I thought, oh, this would be right up your alley to help me with this uh, lighting situation. Because that's kind of the little piddly like stuff he likes to do. I do have a lot of trouble with my hands working with small stuff now. Mm -hmm. Those spastic movements my hand will do for no apparent reason. Well, I'm, I'm starting to get arthritis. Mm -hmm. So there's some things that I have trouble grabbing. This is really short. I'll put some of this into here. So, but I'm still muddling through. Yes. Until, until I can't hold nothing else in my hand, then, I, then I'll stop. <laughs> anyway, what I really feel is my finger where that I use for my mouse, not my, you know, 
the most. That, that finger is really feeling the arthritis. I have a friend who has the kind that her fingers are bent, you know. Oh, I've At a young age. Her, her started bending really there, young. There's a, there's a crafter, I can't remember her name, that she crafts with her fingers bent. Mm-hmm. I was like, wow. Yeah, manage. You just got to. You don't have a choice. Mm-hmm. I mean, you do it or you don't. And so best, do the best you can with what you got. And I try. I try. <laughs> Robin says, oh, I forgot to hit send. Oh, okay. Uh, what do we say? Like, uh, did we lose everybody? Oh, no, I'm, our face. We got four watching, but I'm not sure yeah, what four. Okay. I'm going to finish this light if it takes me all day. Not all day here, but mm -hmm. Audra Smith. Hey, girls, you asked for someone to message you to see yes. if everything is working, so hello. Well, it is working. Thank you so much, Audrey. Do you know Audra? Mm -hmm. I know. So maybe I'm yours. Hey, you don't mind? Audra? Good glad to have you here. I'll check real quick. The next mini collab, what is the theme? We don't have a theme. Yeah, it's not. It's just whatever you want to do that's small. You can take um, a craft that you like to do and just make it small. Is there anything you'd particularly like to do? You do everything. You, I mean, these are. Um, I'll do it on your channel. Why don't you do a small painting, Robin? I'll do it on your channel, um, Jerry. You, you could do some small paintings. I don't want to um, put a theme because some people that didn't get to finish their projects for the last one want to continue are, are continuing to work on it. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's and, just um, it's a little. It's your take on tiny treasure. So whatever. Little I, I don't want. I don't want, to, I don't want to, to get discouraged saying, "Oh, I I was making this and and now you changed it." You got Ann Th Ann Thompson on your channel too. Well, hey Ann, Ann for joining. Hello, Ann. Ann. Appreciate that. How are you doing today? Um, I just don't have a lot of the long blonde pieces left on this pelt. Cop chopping up. Come on, light. I have both of them working. Exciting. It was working. One more time. Yeah, what that is um, not encouraging. I'll just say, mm -hmm. for us, not as far as people who haven't don't really do a lot with electricity. <laughs> okay, that one's working. They were working. I, I, I don't know if it when I when I pulled it to add the third one. Right. If, if it just the wire loops. no, they they they're working. They're both working. Okay. Maybe I'm not, I'm not tying them, tying them, tying them just right. Hmm. You know when you when you twist the wire together. Mm hmm I know. I love that they look ghostly right now for sure. Is that one of your ghost girls? Yeah. She just needs a little bit more hair on top of her head. It doesn't have to. Well, yeah, it kind of does need to be long. I'm running out of long hair on this particular pelt, so right, it's a little bit of issue. And Thompson said, good. Because I've had a couple people, you know, saying, oh, I, I want to join the next one because I, I didn't get to finish what I was working right. on. Right. I think it gives it gives you a more variety to what, what to work with uh -huh. than having a theme. Maybe in the future we'll have themes, but to start off with. Oh, but oh, I do need to say in July that I do have a post. Uh, I, I'm just not the the little um, 
a person who has her little store and everything, but she does have a theme for the whole month of July where every day there's, there's something that you do. You don't have to, partic to, to participate in every single one, but you, you, um, I'm going to go back to my thing. My, my little thing is probably going to come on. If I can't hit it fast enough, community tab, come on. Oh my gosh, it's taking me forever. It's probably, I'm probably running really slow too. Yeah, everything's running slow. Mm-hmm. Come on. I know, I thought I posted around my feed. Very, very frustrating. Mm-hmm. Not that it that that is not working. I'm not don't know for some reason it doesn't want to. Uh huh. I I connect the, the the individual lights and they work. And but when when I start connecting all the three wires, it it gets wonky. I guess I need to put it on my other one. What's going on? I swear I posted her thing on my page. As a post or shared her post. Maybe that's different. If you share a post, it comes up different. Hmm. Look at my messages. Wow. This is crazy. I really thought I shared it. I know that's a different thing. Let me look at something real quick. Profile. Video saved, tagged, posts. I'm in my posts. Tagged. Okay. I don't know what to say about that but we'll look at my messages because she messaged me hmm nothing I, I vintage dollhouse shop got it but it's called vintage dollhouse shop what, what is it all about she vintage dollhouse shop. I, I I do not know. She is on Instagram, and you know I don't know if she has a uh, YouTube channel. But you're basically posting video stuff. This is an I think it's all done on Instagram. Audra um, says she's new, but she loves to craft. Yeah, she has. Welcome. Well, I can't I can't see if it's working. Is that working? Y'all see it? Can y'all see that July mini fun post? Or do I not know what I'm doing here? Oh, why doesn't it let you do it? Oh, you're driving me crazy. Never mind. Let me do this. Is, is, is it? It's it's probably over two hundred characters. Maybe. Let me see if I can I'll open this in the new one. Oh my gosh, one more try and keep trying this stuff if nothing is working. Hmm. I'm going to cut these and re strip them. So I don't have any slides. I have no slides. Google Slides, your computer. Currently, Google Slides. Uh, apparently, I have to put it, save it as a slide, and I don't have any Google Slides. Oh, my gosh. Anyway, let me just read it. I'll just go and read it, because apparently, <laughs> she has no clue what she's doing right now. Okay, J July 1st, share any mini. And all she wants you to do is go and hit hashtag. Let me make sure you add hashtag july mini fun one word hashtag july mini fun uh, and also tag at vintage doll house shop and hashtag july mini fun to join okay so share any minis the first number two is something old and then something new, something blue, in sunlight, all that glitter. So every day is a different thing. We hear sound, lights, action. I don't think anybody's participating in that. We. I think that'd be cute if you could do a uh, stop motion. You could probably do something like that for mm -hmm. it. Yeah. I will post that on my, well, I'm saying I'm going to do that. But you can see all the trouble I'm just having today. Jerry. Um, community, 
So one more try. Image and drop it in. You said, but image. I really am. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to get that on. Go back to our thing. And I need to put hashtag vintage doll shop. Mm -hmm. right. house shop oh the house shop and she does have a lot of cool stuff for sale and it's um july mini fun all right i'm putting that on post that in my community hopefully it pops up this time there it is so yeah itsy bitsy Unfinished, but I can show you a lot of stuff. Landscape, that's good. So yeah, participate. Now you just uh, post your photos on Instagram. And I guess if you have like a YouTube and you're doing a video, you can add that as well. But that's all for July. Good way to connect to that community. It's so like it's outside, easy for me then all the batteries. Gotcha, girl, gotcha. Oh my gosh, so much snow turned up. I, um, I got some uh i got some lights i need to go fix there are solar lights and i just, I just never turned them on this year <laughs> you know never i never never did it never switched them back on i don't i gotta go check them make sure they're still working all right i need to let my babies dry because i'm really bad about messing with their hair and then that be dry and then the hair falls out and we don't want that so my baby come my baby have hair what do you think baby hairs baby hairs are so hard to do okay i think i have three duds wow that is the worst look it's good. I, I do this one right mm -hmm. i grab the two ends and, and i have the battery pack here on and do this right and Where is it? Negative, positive, lights on. You see it? Lighting. So my baby's got freaky hair. So that one's lighting. Now let's try this one. It's not as hard as I'm making it look, guys. Oh, that one's working too. Okay. Let's try this again. One light, one light. Positive. I just okay. what I'm using is this is some fluff from the other uh, pieces that I had. I'm just adding the fluff to my baby. That's um, just what do you mean. What do you mean by fluff? Oh, from like when I was cutting off pieces of hair. You have a lot of you know how dogs have like an undercoat. So there was okay. I was all that out as I was because uh -huh. uh, I just wanted the long strands. So it was just like the short strands of hair and they oh, were okay. just kind of fluffy. So I'm calling it fluff. It's kind of what it is. Gotcha. I think what's nice and about the working with this craft is that it's a good, um, you don't have as much invested in it. So, well, I know, we spent a lot of money on stuff. Uh, uh, hello? I know, right? I was like, oh, yeah. <laughs> but, um, you can do it for very, you can do um, the things you can make. I got cardboard. Amazing. Amazing. So that gives you a, just, it's just something to, I'm using a lot of map board now more than I thought I would. I really like using map board. So that kind of stuff, it's, it's all very doable. And then when his hair is dry, I'm trimming it. I promise you, I'm not leaving it with the, And then my, my other little boy, little boy right there, who has no legs. He has got no legs. Let me see how my mom is doing. How's your hair doing? It's getting there. I have little strands of other colors. 
which will blend better when I start messing with it. Seriously. Yes, Bill. I am. I don't know what that was about, but oh, okay. what time is it? Is that like, what time is it anyway? Five. Oh, uh, okay. Well, you know, it's mm. typ that's typical. Yep. Okay. She says I started using. Okay, you're right. she's on that. Okay, I thought I had a new post. I was like, what? Wait, I didn't read that. So yes, the fun of styling her hair will be. Oh, another thing. I don't know what happened here. I got a little bit too much glue. I need to pull that back now before it gets too carried away. Give me an idea. Why some red hair you got, chick? Really red. Mm -hmm. She had that one brown streak going through her hair. Kind of weird. Now I gotta do this down. I know y'all can't see what I'm doing. That lot of wood there. Uh, that is, uh, those are my uh, st star sticks that I stole from the airport. Um, that uh, they, they didn't have, I was mad because they had no chocolate chip cookies. So I was just gonna take a couple to just kind of get the idea of what I needed to go look for to order. But when I went in, there was no chocolate chips, I was, cookies. I, I said, oh, I'm taking more then. <laughs> No, I was going to, my adventure, <coughs> uh, fancy air, my, these are the airports where you're, um, you fly in the little planes. So, yeah, they have cookies and treats for their. Uh, They're going to have a, a, a picture of you um, for next time you come through. Be careful with this lady. She still star sticks. <laughs> Yes, she is a she's that lady that's a star stick lady. Oh, the lady who's you know, well, they just they're just kind of weird over there. It's like, are you really going to pull a jet up to the front door and and turn it on? Have you lost your mind? They did. They they lost their minds. A so I need my little rubber bands from the house because that really helps to style their hair when you have the rubber bands to get their hair up. But you can see she's going to have an interesting hairline when it's all said and done. Well, I'm going to do this later. I'm, I'm... Yeah, you let it go. Time to let that one go for a while. I'll show you what I did with the other little one. Because that one's on. I put it over this picture. Mm-hmm. Let's see if you can turn the light off for a second. So it's kind of, is it, you did kind of aim it towards to highlight the picture? Mm -hmm. My husband calls my new wife. Uh, uh -oh. Oh, what was that? My, my drill. Oh, no, yeah. <sighs> is my chair, any cable or something, whatever is, is, is hanging down? Mm -hmm. Any tiles on it? My arm grabs it and pulls it every time I turn. Because mm -hmm. the drill's fine. <laughs> oh, you're okay. That's what's important. I'm not okay. Oh, no. Let me turn this light off. I think this is too bright, too. There we go. That one right there. Oh, it looks awesome. Right there. So yeah. I, I, just, I just have to pull it out more to, to get it. Yeah, that's definitely something I would need for my little do that little dollhouse box I did for mm -hmm. our um, summer ween. Yeah, uh, something that gives you a little bit of light that I can make it look like the fire and things like that. Didn't have it. Didn't have what I needed. <laughs> I just have to to glue it down and so it, so that's gonna be like that. I think it's cute. Extra light over there. Uh -huh. It's gonna be awesome. Put, when I put the chair over here, I'm gonna put a little lamp next to the chair. Uh -huh. so I'll probably string the light through the through um somewhere around here in the side to get to the to the lamp. Yeah. Oh, you gotta make one of those standing lights, so, you know, to go by the. Nah. So my not not another project, please. 
No, I'm but, making yeah, the, the a light. You know what I'm talking about? The, the standing light, the crochet yeah, or whatever. I'm making a table, a side table with the light coming out of it. Okay. That's what I'm, I want to do. Ah, her hair stuck to me. Let, me, let me check something out. These were batteries that I had in my desk. Who knows mm -hmm. how old they are? My son gave me a new set of batteries. Maybe the other set was too old or something. Used up. Ann Thompson says that she saw someone do a dollhouse in an old suitcase. Oh, isn't that adorable? I love that idea. I do. I saw someone take the Folgers um, container and mm -hmm. make a little coffee house inside of it. Oh, that's perfect. I, I do like the laundry rooms that the person was making on Facebook. Did you see those out of the jugs, out of the laundry detergent jugs? Those were adorable. Yeah. Those were so adorable. Yeah, I got to quit messing with my dolls here. I'll start pulling it out. But yeah, she's going to have this bun thing going and all that. So, leave her to be. Let that poor woman dry, my child. My child needs a little bit more hair, I think. She is looking. I got to have enough to pull back away from her face and then have hair coming down her back. I don't know where you're going. Uh, I'm going to go crawl under the covers now. Tom may need more hair just because her. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're looking kind of scary, my dear. You are actually looking a little creepy. But isn't she a ghost? She is, but I, 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 I put a lot of dark on her hairline, and you can see all that dark coming through her skull, and it's looking like, you know, well, like <laughs> creepy in there. She's definitely a ghost. Yeah, I think she needs a little bit more hair. Done. I can't tell. Your hair is so thin. Power box in the bedroom. You got a what? He's looking for a power hey, box. Hey, Bobby, how you doing? Yeah. Hey, Bobby. We just playing dolls. Jerry's trying to do play doll here right now with these. Uh oh, what happened? What happened? She hit a button. She hit a button. Added you, Nancy. Following now. Thank you for that. That's awesome. So somewhere did a dollhouse in us. So yeah, that was. So um, there she's back. Now something wrong with her device. Uh, yeah, I'm trying to get this little girl's hair. So on this doll, she actually has like a strand of hair that comes down her back on this particular scalp. And I'm trying to work her scalp, her hair into that to hide that part. You see how my like dark, you know, that dark part? Yeah, I kind of cover that up with something. Because that's looking a little creepy. She needs a little bit more hair. I didn't want to have too much hair. I mean, I can color, I can paint it the color of her hair and it would look better. Kind of thinking about doing that. Although the gray does look kind of creepy and nice. <laughs> Good in a creepy way. Yay. Well, until she might, there she's, she's coming back. I'm back. Oh. Thank you, Ann. I need to move my mouse because every time I turn my chair, it, 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 it wants to do something. Did you just unplug something else? No. No. No, I have my mouse attached to the arm of my chair. Okay. So every time I move my chair, the, the, it hits the table. Mm -hmm. and, and then the yeah. mouse. So gets the, then when I cut off my stuff, this is the fuzz I was talking about. It's just whatever I pull out of this end that I was getting the hair for the other, for the little baby hair. For the baby. 
What, Jay? They just trusted me. They, they just give, give me the password, passcode to the watch and phone. Okay, yeah, trust, trust me. For the passcode for the iPad. It should be 3299. Yeah, I'm going to give her a little bit more hair to cover up that gray area. It, that, that whole gray area. Because she looks a little bit like she's decomposing. She's a ghost, not not a not a zombie. Uh, two different things, huh? Yes! It's just kind of, if, you know, these like light things that just float around. Zombies. Zombies are like, I don't know, what are zombies? <laughs> kind of, um, brain eating what you call it. yeah they're more much more uh, interactive i'll just say that <laughs> very interactive they want to eat your eat you eat your brain All right, so now I kind of filled it. Oh, kind of filled this. She's just a hot mess. I filled in some of that area with some hair, and hopefully it will look better now when it's all dry and I can style it. You got some long hair. It will get cut. Yeah, the best thing is just just to go for it. Just let it go because then you're gonna come back and fix it. Don't worry about that part. And like I said, the baby, the baby's just a frizzy mess right now. Why are you? I can turn it back. Oh, I can't. Got glue on you. Too much glue. I'm gonna add each light to to the each battery pack until uh -huh. I figure out what why they they don't want to light up right. together. Is that just some experimenting? Yeah. Because yep. this one's this one's this one's on. So let's put this one in. So what I did with my other baby, when they with all this extra hair that was up here, I used glue and water to kind of make a to style it, so I could get it to go up in this little pointy thing that it's makes it so cute. You kind of have to. I mean, that's kind of what's got to have to happen. I oh, do have a little water. I just have to put a little bit of water in. That would be nice. Don't have anything over here for right now. There we go. Now get the other battery pack. <laughs> just get it put on my purple now. It's Elmer's glue is the better glue, but I don't see any Elmer's candy. I don't have any Elmer's. The Mod Podge. This kind of thing, right? Five years back now, she was watching Lola's video. Oh my gosh! Yeah, I got. I have a video I was supposed to do. I just haven't done it yet. I don't know. That was one of my projects. I thought I was going to work on today. That's, that's no. That, that's no big deal. I, I'm. I have a, a patriotic video I need to 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 edit, and I think July fourth is going to come here before I have the video ready. Oh yeah. Yeah. I sit, I, down, I sit down and do it, and and everything just. I don't know. Oh yeah, either, either my computer dies. You kidding me? Either my computer has you know a hiccup or something, and it, mm -hmm. or I'm not feeling it. And yeah, hang on, let me just. I just have the cross. Oh, I did find my hard coat. Um, I did not make it up. I actually do have it. Oh, this is a new ball. There's I need Elmer's over here, but anyway, it was in this kind of container. But I do have the hard coat stuff that I need to put on those um, 
Thanks, Ahmed. Uh, I, I made some mini books for my library at Fabi. Mm -hmm. I need to make 200 more. <laughs> and, and I'm then, working on my babies, on my peoples. And so he's got like hair going everywhere. So I got to trim it. And then I added some columns to either side of my desk to add some lighting for their fake columns. And that's what I've been fiddling with the last hour. Trying to get yeah she, she's been wrestling with those lights so, so not everything is all easy pieces we're just saying sometimes you're faced with some challenges there we go. To tiny things like this hairdo yeah only 200 more books no big deal but i found a way to do it that that i made um was it nine books in 15 minutes yeah you did the book the books were the best part <laughs> my crazy looking baby I love it. I think it's well, awesome. I was able to do fifteen books. I mean, seven books in fifteen minutes. So, no big. The the way I I found um this lady that made them on YouTube. Not YouTube. Um, she she did a blog post. And um. I'll I'll link that um blog post with the free printables that she has. And then I'm working with um, the lighting that's giving me a pain right now. It, it worked fine at the beginning. No, it's fine. I have to actually tease this hair. I have to tease it to order it to get to do right. I know. That's why I, I can't mess with it while it's still, but I can't help but play with it a little bit. It's just fun. But I tried to add a third light to the okay. battery pack. To the battery pack and it didn't work. So... I'm doing individual pa battery packs for now until I figure out what the problem is. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Ann. She loved the baby. There's a funny baby. She's a little haunted baby. I have another baby. Let me find This is bigger. Oh, where are you? How am I going to find it? Over here? Probably not. No, no. Nothing's ever in reach. Why isn't anything ever in my reach? Now I'd have to go around and get him. Oh, I do have some stuff I could work on while I'm sitting here, like glue furniture to get. That's not a good sound. Where did that come from? Behind me or in front of me? Oh man. Please don't be in front of me. Is that a doll part that just fell? No. What just fell? Was that in your place or mine? Not mine. I heard something fall. Yes, I oh, did. Yeah. Okay, it was this. I don't know what it hit. Look at these stupid things. It's not a glass when it hit. Anyway, oh, I gotta take stuff in the house. Oh, I can work on my cat. And my gray cat. And he's working on. Is your table in the middle of your room? Mm hmm. Okay. Yeah. Pretty much. Yeah, pretty centered. Right under the light. Mm hmm. Fabi says, I put my craft space to the other side of the room uh -huh. in Campbell's. I have no clue now if I'm going live tomorrow. I need to figure out something out as soon as possible. So you moved it. <coughs> um, and I think it's behind you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I need to do, I, I really need to clean. I kind of made a big mess here, so I can't find, I never can find anything now. So, hey, we have when you clean it, and then, um, and then I messed it up again, and I don't know. It's just crazy. Don't mind all this mess back here. I will be covering all that later. I shouldn't be working where I have doll hair, because it gets on everything. My lights are on again. All of them worked. Yes. Amazing. We're okay. on separate separate battery pack. Okay. I'll, I'll, I'll figure that out. I just tried to do like a little bit of an antiquing effect on this cat to see what happens. This is just my uh what color is this cat? I forgot. I don't even remember. But I wanted a gray cat, so I've put some gray, just sprayed it with some gray primer, a plastic primer. And now I'm just adding black paint with my favorite product, my floating medium, which I could be just using a black antiquing gel. Oh, I can't hold anything. See, do something. 
just to kind of give my cat some more depth. And you get that black cat and add some gray to it to kind of brighten it up because it's just black. I don't know if, if I can do something here. Maybe. I don't know if it's, it's, it's a good size or not. To drill a hole on top of this guy here and put mm -hmm. the light light the light through it i'll probably paint yeah. the, the top black right here and then put this like right here with with a with a, a, a an arm or something so we like that can you see that no you can't anyway by adding that extent that um Lighting medium, it just kind of did the same effect that it, with the wax. Whoops, I can't hold it. And with the wax, it's sorry, it's upside down. Uh, so it, Hello, Maria. it would go, hey, Maria. And so it goes down into the uh, grooves, you know, the, the cat's hair, and then I can kind of knock it off the top, more highlights. Bringing it closer. Because I have these little, little glass containers from Dollar Tree. I could mm -hmm. probably paint this black on top. I put like an arm, right? So it's, like it's coming out of the wall here, and drill a hole to put the light inside. So it'll look like this. That'd be good. With the with the light inside. Where is it? There you go. Like that. How does that look? I love it. Now, what what would you say you got from Dollar Tree? There was a bottle. These little bottles. The jars. Okay, it was the jars. Okay, yeah, the little. Is it that's a plastic one, right? Yeah, I oh, like glass. that. It's glass. Oh, that one is the glass. Oh, yeah. Okay, so mm -hmm. see, now he's got a lot more depth. Anyway, so this is just a little Dollar Tree cat that I can't remember what color he was. He may have been gray at the begin with. I don't know, but or black. I don't know. I think it was black. I didn't want two black cats, so I just um, I added the black paint. Uh. Of my floating medium to create the kind of the same effect y'all are getting with your waxes and stuff, your antiquing effect. But it, it really highlighted that, um, or I should say, give depth to his fur, like that. That distressing look. He's so distressed. And then I can kind of take some of it off the top. And I didn't get his tail because I couldn't do it. And I'll do it the same time. Don't so, tip his tail. And this stuff is drying really fast on this plastic for some reason. Well, I didn't. I didn't show the the wall of books I'm to to the new people. Yeah, yeah. Show your books. Oh, the, the the wall that I'm adding to the front of the, the library. There we go. Okay. And says, good idea for the light scones. Mm -hmm. Beautiful touches on the cat. You're working on a cat? Yeah, this cat, little cat right okay. here. Okay. Because I'm over here working, and, and finally goes, beautiful touches on the cat. I'm like, what cat? I get the cat my cat some gold metallic eyes because it's sitting here. Actually, I probably need to do yellow. Probably just do yellow and see what happens. And then add the metallic. Come on. So I'm grabbing some paint out of here. My paint's really old. I don't know what to do for dinner tonight. I hate it when it's five o'clock and I have whatever time it is. Uh, for some, I have no idea what dinner is going to be tonight. I'm not painting with a I'm painting with a stick instead of a. So I can get a good point. The tiny eye. Here we go. Lights are on. So this is what I'm going to do for the front here. It's not necessary. I just I just want to do something different. Add more work to myself. Yeah. The chair goes there. I got I got myself a little cat too. I'm probably, but I didn't do nothing to it. Yes, I got a cat. That you had a cat and a puppy. Yeah, the puppy somewhere. Uh, I think the yeah, cats I had a couple of cats. I saw so a Pomeranian right here somewhere. This. I need to 
finish painting it. Can you see the eyes? It's um, like giant books. And I, I reinforced it with some dowels in the back. So it's nice. That looks print. amazing. So it's going to go. Good right idea. In front of the library. Mm -hmm. So when it's on the, book on the bookshelf, it looks like this. And I think that is so cute. So when, when you want to open it, you just, it's going to have hinges so you can open it. And I'm going to dim down the light so everybody can see see how the lights look now. All right, then I came back with the gold metallic so the eyes would pop a little bit more. But by backing them with the gold paint, it just helps that gold show up better. So um, I have a light, a light here over this little painting. Mm -hmm. And then I have the lights on the on the either side of the desk. I love it. I just, that and is amazing. You have a paint, First of all, you're going to have, hey, do me a favor. Yeah. Take your book, that book cover you made, and just kind of set it on top like it's a roof. Because that's when it's like in the shelf, what it's going to look like. Yeah. yeah. So just set it in there, kind of give us an idea. See how adorable. That looks so good. That is amazing. She's well, amazing. I'm going to be, this is going to be painted, too, so, so it's not going to be this, this bare this, wood. This is, this is truly a little treasure. And, and you're if you were here earlier, this is what I'm going to use for my picture window. So I'm going to be making a frame and doing some paints. And using some some clear acetate mm -hmm. and make it look like a window and it's gonna go like right here there be great so i'm gonna finish the roll top desk finish the painting of the walls in the window and then i need to work on the chair for the desk no big and deal then, just you know punch lift and a, a couple up. hundred books a couple other books. You got it. You got that. I still got over a month to, to, to finish it, right? Yeah. I know. Isn't that a good scene? Well, she had like a choice of two, and uh, they're both good, but I just like that fall colors for some reason. I I voted for that one. I think that with the colors of the library, this fall color looks better. That's a creepy looking cat. Cat. And I got this bottle cap that I used to make um, pendants years ago. Uh -huh. Put it right here over the desk and put a clock clock face on it. And then I have, where are they? I printed also oh, on the- Another thing you can always find online are some really good clock, clock faces. Yeah. Hold on a second. Where's my the other sheet of coffee paper? It's hiding, no. My very, very old bottle of white. Okay, enough, Nancy. My heart can't take no more. No, she's just, she's just awesome. She does a just brilliant job with this her little thing. I had a, oh, I'm, I, I'm also gonna make a, a record player. Doing all this stuff gets me, gets me, stays, gets me um, out of trouble. Mm -hmm. Like I get in, like I go anywhere to get in trouble. <laughs> so I gotta figure out how to put an arm on these little canisters. Okay, my worst thing is my downtime when I'm looking at uh, other stuff and like, oh, but I need, I, I'd rather buy that than make that. <laughs> then these things like, I don't need that. I don't want to make it. But See, you know, definitely need, need to make stuff because it does. It does. It just has its own look. I'm just saying. I it printed some some album, album covers myself. and some albums, so I'm gonna do that. And then um, I even have a little farmhouse kitchen book that I'm gonna make. But I have another. <laughs> this cat is crazy. Look at this cat's face. It's just it's just weird looking. <laughs> it's weird. I'm telling y'all. What do you do? You can't help it. Look, look, look at its maker. Yeah, I've got all these books to cut and, and glue. And I know, those are just amazing. Well, so that's kind of cool. All the different books you can find. You can actually have a whole uh, library of completely different books. Mm -hmm. and, and it looked pretty legit. So do it. Go for it. I encourage all of you. 
It doesn't have to be a whole room like I'm doing. I'm I'm, I'm just I'm just extra. <laughs> mm-hmm. I think it's really cute. People are buying like this, the, making a little cabinet I, I, I would, and just I would, having the cabinet full of stuff, you know, that kind of thing. I don't I don't mind doing, you know, all the dog tree stuff, DIYs and stuff like that. But it was getting a little blah for me. So I, I needed something else to get me jump started. I do have, uh, like I said, try to get that patriotic video out mm -hmm. using probably Tara blocks. But like I said, I, I'm feeling blah for some reason. Yeah. So for now, I'm, I'm making things that, that make me happy and not stressed. Exactly. And I think that's what's the best, that's the best, best part of the fun mm -hmm. channel is that don't, and I, and I've been going through a lot wanting to, I do want to quit so many times because it's, it is hard work some days. It's just really hard work and to not be getting, um, not to not be getting the views, but to just not be, and it's a lot of it's me not go, wanting to go the extra mile, I guess, to because um, I'm like I've already put this much work into I, it. I wanted to say get a little people, bit jaded, just saying. To, to 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 people that don't know about YouTube, they just watch it. They don't they don't actually work in it. Mm -hmm. That um, if you watch even thirty seconds of an ad in our channel, that helps us. Don't skip the ads. Yeah, because that, that's I did with the non skippable. Let me tell you why I did on mine because I've on my own experience with the skippable ads. Um, I, if I am d working with my hands and you get on those uh skippable, the kinds that you can go three, two, one, you know, skip ad, I, I am not necessarily in a place where I can just stop what I'm doing and reach up. I've got paint on me or something or not near my thing to and I just mm -hmm. sit there and listen to that ad run. For, and some of those ads are not short. So that's why I just said. You mean, you mean the 30, 30 minute ad? I know. I've, I'm like, what is this ad? This is like, is, wait, am I on the wrong video? And it's just an ad. Yeah, for another, it's some crazy ad. But I think I think mine is set up. A, I just try to do the really short ads. Okay, so there's my kitty, and I'll hit it with some spray with the crazy but eyes. That, that helps. And sharing with your friends. Mm -hmm. Sharing is always good. Commenting after we finish the video also helps. Comments help. And go to visit the other person's. Like, because we're on two different things. You'll be if you're watching on her channel, she's getting the views. If you're watching on my channel, I'm getting the views. But you can go and visit the other channel and like watch half one of it there and some on the other one, and then we both get credit, and that's very helpful. But yeah, I think my time is limited. I have like a countdown date, and and it's like this will be like the last year I do this. So, and if I even make it through this year. Just saying, but I still will do what I do and probably post things on Instagram. I probably still post things because it's on, like, if I finish a doll or something, I'll post it. But as far as the, and as far as uh, the the collaborations are fun, I've been getting some good views on this last one, the Summer Ween. But it's um, and it was things I was doing anyway, so it all worked out for me. But there's just a lot of collaborations I just can't do because I'm not doing that stuff anymore. I don't wish I think about the there's a lot of money involved in this. I don't know if y'all realize buying craft supplies, doing that kind of yeah. stuff. You do spend the money. And That's why 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 watching the ads and yeah and sharing and stuff really helps. It's so magical, lighter at night. Oh, it's gonna be amazing. That that how that little room is gonna be, I mean, it's just the sweetest. If, you have if, lighting in your other room, right? No, I I have um a puck light under the under the uh -huh. yeah that's the right case. that's what you did but i might since i have three extra lights here if, if i could get them to work mm -hmm. I, I could put them in the in the bedroom right so that way i can light the bedroom up without the puck light but it, it still works and i have the the i started the farms farmhouse stand mm -hmm. i've started it i have the tree already on it that's right is there a solo wood flower collaboration 
I don't know. No one's mentioned it to me. I have a, a, an affiliate link with them. Mm-hmm. But what I've what I've gotten is not free. I I bought I bought all my flowers. So I hope I got my comb in here. Let's see if this will work. And it says it's so fun to find other people that like this stuff. Yes, it is. Yeah, it is, and and then you find stuff. You do most of it for your just for your community anyway. That's it. Is more it's fun. That's the best part. Yeah. Oh, there's no light. I had a little painting that I want. Oh well, but I'm going to hold on. I'm going to show you guys the, the little. They have solo wood and candle in that. You mean for affiliate link, Robin? Because I have that. For your which one? For solo wood flowers. Yeah. But I, I I don't I don't get free flowers. And this is what I'm so hold on. That guy right there. Yeah. I'm gonna Aww. make him. Aww. It's gonna be a record player. I had another little um paint printable that I had um some other stuff that I wanted to show, but it, it like disappeared. Oh well. I have these. This was, this, was, this was one sheet. I said, I'm going to do her hair. Oh, it was, on top, it was attached to the... So it is smaller. Mm. But here, I'll, I'll, I'll link this um, link down below. You get all these little... They're, they're generic covers. Mm -hmm. uh, they look antique. All different colors, and here's the other one. I kind of, I, I kind of want my girl's hair. I don't know why I want the mom. I got to think about this mom. How I want her hair done. I kind of like it down too. I think she looks really cool. And, and just a, a reminder: Ju July seventh is the collaboration with Craft Organization, hosted by Crafty Peep. Yes, and I believe um, Fabi is a co-host or a she is also. Yes, that's right. Yes, and you'll see what I use this for. The hole saw. Mm. It cuts holes in things. Easiness. I had fun making it. It killed my it killed my arm making it, but I I, I still had fun because I. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. What's well, fifty six? No. Seven times eight. Yeah, fifty six. I drilled fifty six holes. Okay, that's some cry cry. What are you up to, woman? You got do you guys want a sneak peek? Yeah, you got, yeah, I just pulled hair out. See, you, you got to let it sit. I, gotta, I do need to add more hair to her oh. anyway. The oh. more I look at her, the more hair. She Sorry, cable, cable won't let me go, go any further than this. Sorry. No. Hold on, let me see if I, if I switch to, to the other camera. 
I can, I can, it'll, it'll be upside down with, with the other camera, but you, you'll be able to see it. You guys ready? Yes. Are you ready? Hang on now. Let me, let me switch that to make you big. Hang on. Yeah. Now we're ready. Ready, 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 ready. Oh, you did not. That's awesome. That was a great sneak. Love that sneak. <laughs> awesome sneak. That that week I'm going to be doing my live instead of Thursday on a on Friday because mm -hmm. Friday is my birthday. Oh, she got birthday. Like, Lots of birthdays. Good job. That's awesome. Oh. So since I have this video going out the seventh, I mean like okay, I have a video going out that day. Mm -hmm. So I, I just want to have fun with my friends on my birthday, even if it's virtual. Yes. There's a piece of, of, of printable that I can't find, but I'll, I'll probably find it when I finish. So August 13 is the next miniature collab. Your take on tiny treasures. Mm -hmm. And what day does that fall on? Because I'm not paying attention to anything. It's going a on Saturday there. at 6 p.m. Uh, okay. Eastern. I'm in it a little bit later this time. And September, when is the, the, your take, I mean, found objects? It's September. Yeah. September 10th. 10th. Don't ask me the time. I do not remember. I'll find yeah. out. Yeah. <laughs> I have my phone I don't here. Know. I don't have any memory. Oh, I am co-hosting um, Christmas in July with Mama Mia DIY. Oh, really? And that's July 25th. I'm supposed to be doing some Christmas in July stuff, but we'll see. Um, it's September 10th at 6 p.m. for the found object. Okay. Yes. I think that's that's all I'm in right now that I've committed. Mm -hmm. I think that's plenty. <laughs> it is. <clears throat> this is the other picture I was going to use for the... Oh, here we go. For the window but I, I went for the more fall this one because it matches more the the, the library that, than the other one but i'm going to be doing this making a window frame out of my quarter inch dowels like this right mm -hmm. and then with the smaller um smaller coffee stirs i'm going to do all Allie's, Al I forgot, is, is that Allie? Allie is all about minis. Yeah, Allie. Yeah. Hey, hey, how y'all doing? Hey, um, we're kind of winding down for the day, but we we have had a big day. T tell them to look, go ahead and, I just play dolls pretty much, uh, but I'm working on my dolls and I'm adding hair. So this is something I'm just trying and it's, you I'm can, adding like, pieces of fluff like I did on of the hair like kind of water just to kind of give her like a the ready or hair up near her scalp maybe make her hair look you can, you can make yourself big if, if you need to oh it's just yeah this is what my nails look like before right, I did right. hair. I'll do it for you hot mess yeah so she's getting her hair did <laughs> and it's a mess <coughs> right now it's still in the what stages you, what, of, what are you doing to me but i have I'm to going, get, i have to let things dry i'm really bad about messing i'm with going them. back to um Fabi says that's so cool my husband bought those for me what did he, he buy for you and why don't they work what are you talking about uh I, I don't know what she's talking about. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I tell what you guys like. The thing is, the, the, the chat is so far behind from what, what we talk about. Right. Well, what are you talking about Maybe. again? Uh, anyway, Allie, I don't know if you caught them, but we were announcing upcoming challenges, coming, I mean, uh, collaborations coming up, and we do have one in August 13th for our next mini challenge. I hope you will participate. And it's open. You can do one thing. You can do a whole bunch of things. It's up to you. And there's no thing because it's just making something, you know, little. And since you do littles, there it is. Yeah, perfect. 
You just grab something that you, that you, you you've been wanting to make. You, Second, I, I, oh. I, I use I use um eight, um what was it hmm. eighth inch eighth inch um plywood eighth inches yeah. no it's it's thinner than than the eighth inch hold on why's my phone going off over here oh my sister because it's not sixteenth I'm confused. Yeah, eighth inch. It's not this board, but it's about that thick. But it was plywood. This is basswood. This is this is softer wood. Mm hmm This is this is what I use for these panels here. That's what I look like in the morning out. There you go. There you go. Woo! Yeah, <laughs> I'm I'm gotta just ah can't stand it. God, because I gotta let, let her dry, Jerry. Let her dry. Let that paint dry. Let that glue dry. And then this is my little girl who's also got the same situation here going on. Ah! I'm sorry. <laughs> and I'm going to kind of do it with her like I did where I just put the shorter hairs in to kind of give it that fluff that it needs to kind of give that hair some extra poof. And and you, if you have too much hair, they look weird. So I just, but she does need a little extra fluff in here. So I'm gonna give her some glue. I, I was I, I was working with a magnet earlier today. Uh -huh. I made this guy right here, my little minion, but he's going for for my diamond painting. But oh. it has it has a magnet on the back. Look. Hang on a sec. Let me see. Oh yeah, yeah. So um, I I I pulled out the two magnets. And I'm looking for it and looking for it, and I couldn't find the other magnet. Well, look where I found it. It's on my metal ruler. Oh, uh, I um, uh, yeah, I had the magnets <laughs> disappeared on me the other day. I, I looked mean, everywhere, oh and they were stuck to my lamp. They fe they fell and hit a lamp, and were mm -hmm. stuck to the lamp. I know. You're like, thanks. Well, I guess that's not a problem. <laughs> But I'm using this for my for my diamond painting. Did they call it a, a cover keeper? Mm -hmm. you have a piece of plastic over the the diamond painting. Oh, uh, okay. So it doesn't doesn't it doesn't um, come off. Oh, okay, I didn't. Yeah, but, this this is all new to me. Because it, okay. it, it, it I'll, I'll show something quick here. Because it it, it it covers the adhesive. Mm hmm And what I was using was a piece of tape. Okay. This is, this is my new one that my husband got me. I was using this piece of tape to hold it up. So instead now, you put this on the top okay. of the plastic like this, right? Yeah, so that filled in some of those bad areas with just some fuzz. And you put the, the, the magnet on top and then the magnet on the bottom, and it keeps that plastic from rolling down on you. Oh, okay. And I had his minion, so I'm like, I, I have to make my own little. And then you slide it out like this. The magnet sticks to it, and you can bring it back down. Okay. But I, I started working on it the, the, the other day. So this is my the, the new one I'm yeah, working on. Yeah, I need, uh, back to my hair, I have to go in the house and get some little tiny rubber bands to kind of help hold the hair up in place when they're in the house. Of course they are. So I keep, my, keep myself busy. Except for this weekend, this weekend I I, I just watch TV and, and 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 um, what do you call it? Couch potato. No. <laughs> clean couch house? Potato. Did you clean house? I did the dishes. Do <laughs> your chores. I, I straightened up the, the living room because the living room is not that big anymore because half mm -hmm. of it's in my in my um, what do you call it? Mm hmm. Your house, is, you live in your studio. Yeah. A lot of artists live in their studios. Come on. It's mostly, mostly the studio, you know? Yeah. It's not, it's not a, that's not an unusual thing. Where did I put it? Hmm. 
My husband's been getting me all kinds of uh, goodies for my birthday. Yeah. It's not my birthday yet. Oh my gosh. So he's 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 been racking up points. He got me Aww, this case. So sweet. He got me this case so I could put all my all my little diamond pe- diamond bits in it. Mm-hmm. It's purple. I it like it. Eyes. And then it has all my little the diamond bits in in the little containers. Oh my gosh, that's insane. I did not know you were going to get into that. Like for reals. I after I after I did the ones that I, that I got. Yeah. And now look at you. Mm-hmm. I didn't get start getting that stuff until I actually finished the, the three that I got from that right. um, new, craft, new craft day. And then I, then um, my husband ordered um, the, the purple butterfly. Mm-hmm. And then he ordered the Grogu on the Mandalorian um, yeah. helmet. And yeah, I will spend hours playing with this doll here. This, you know, I did, I did, I did show it earlier, but now I can't find my desk. I, I think that that once you set something down, it goes mm-hmm. and hides. It goes into the the uh, abyss. Yes. The, we oh, know about the abyss. Is Robin still on? Robin in her abyss. I do and, love that. It, and he got me this pretty um Star Wars shirt with florals. Oh, that looks great. That is so cool. I told me he, he needs to stop buying me stuff. But he every time he, he comes home here, I'm like what? Aww. It's like okay. I was thinking of you. Yes, my husband, my, my son is just whispering. Have you told Miss Jerry about your birthday coming up? <laughs> like, oh yes, he told everybody. She just I told everybody. Celebrate! Y'all's birthdays are so close. Who's you and Jay? You and Jay's birthdays. Oh, Jay was supposed to be born two days after my birthday. Wow. He decided, he de- he decided to come days. early. Three days actually. Three, Three days. days. Robin's still here. I was supposed to be born July 11th. His due date was July 11th. He decided to come um, yeah. June 18th. <laughs> wow. I was, in, I was in the hospital for a week. And they had to do an emergency C-section. Yeah. That's the one year away to be, being an adult. Yeah, he's excited to be 18 next year. I know. That's a, that's a good well, Embrace that's your, eight, your 17th year because uh, you may think it's a boring one, but. That's a, that's a big, big graduation party along with my birthday as well. It, that's true. You're at the, the end of the that's year. A, it'll right? be a big party, big party next year. A big one. Yes, it will. Yeah, because he, he's going to turn 18. He's uh-huh. going to graduate. And his uh-huh. birthday is around the same time. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I know. It's going to be a big, um, be a big birthday. Jay, how you get? Go back to the page before this. Because I, I put the. Hold on. I'm going to see it. I put the wrong email. There we go. Okay. Yeah, so I'll just pull back a little bit of her hair like this and kind of give her and trim all this back it up. Kind of give her some curls or something. But that little hair is so fine. I see that's what all that extra fuzz is on the top. This, this your, your email account, Mommy. I know. Now I know, now I know how to send it to YouTube. Well, you should you shouldn't have to if, if I already signed it sign in. Oh, and he 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 just got his twentieth subscriber. Ooh, I think I'm sad already. I think if I can check, make sure. I think it was because of my birthday. Birth You've been birth. posting your videos though, because it's no, no he, he, he's he's um working on school and he's got That's seven right. more classes. Yeah, yeah, he's got a summer thing he's doing. Mm-hmm. We got to, we went to Dollar Tree and and they had um they had they had um those non generic um Lego brick bricks. Mm-hmm. I was just asking asking when your birthday's there. My birthday's the eighth of July.
think July 9th was the, the uh, release date of uh, Star Wars. Wasn't it like the first one? I don't know. My husband knows all that. I'm 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 just getting into the Star Wars stuff. We 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 watched the Mandalorian a couple of, yeah a few months ago. We, we watched yeah, the, I, I need so I need to just chill out one day. I gotta and just watch. Um, Obi Wan. Obi Wan. Yeah. I haven't had much. Chance. I didn't watch. Um, I, heard, I didn't hear. Oh, by the way, I have to tell y'all this. I did not go see Jurassic Park like we had planned. My sunset oh. world. I'm sorry. Don't say mm -hmm. Park. Jurassic World Dominion because it was. It's just not a good movie. It's a bad movie. It's just a stupid movie. It's so stupid. And they kind of. Yeah. And I, it was telling me about it. And I went, oh, yeah, they totally wrecked that movie. That, that does sound bad. So we said not to see it. Okay. More than worth the money. So, yeah, we're, we're, we're hoping for we just, you know, we've just Jurassic Park, Jurassic Park all over the place too. Yeah, you know, that was our other favorite thing. Well, my son's got Jurassic Park Jeep, but yeah, he drives drives all the way with his friends, and they're all like walk out of there, go you know, all the um the motor pool, the Jurassic Park motor pool out of Texas, and all all over. They all meet up in Branson. For, and I all went to see it, and uh, it was so disappointing. They, they were just walked out going, I can't believe they ruined that franchise, basically. Stupid movie. I said, here, we, as he tells it to me, I go, well, you know, it's, it's a good movie premise, and it sounds like something, you know, uh, Michael Crichton may have put together, but overall, it's too much stuff that was not related to what it should have been about. So it's kind of stupid. That, from that standpoint. Robin says her birthday is the 12th and Larry's is the 19th. Mm, bunch of birthdays. What What is, um, Kathleen said you could get them off Etsy. Let me scroll up. Oh, she has transfers from redesign with Prima. Oh, okay. Yeah, I really got to play with her hair. But her hair's so cool. I miss so long in the back. Oh, see, she's losing hair. Oh, no, no. <laughs> so much hair coming out. I also got some some more um, resin and some more molds to to work. I want to make some pendants. Mm-hmm. So I like to do a little bit of everything. Yeah, I do too. I, I do need to start because every time I want to do something else, I make a really big mess. And then I got that to do with. So stick to this mess for now, just for a little while. The little, the miniature mess. I need a fave. That ain't no miniature mess when she, she got the whole house set up that needs to work. Oh, out. no. Kathleen said she just found her grandson has COVID. Oh, no. We'll, we'll keep him in our, in our prayers. Yeah. And Fabi says, I need a movie. A fave movie for my DIY tomorrow. I don't know. Favorite movie? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Favorite. I don't know. What kind of. I'm trying to think. Robin, so Robin, says, Robin says Encanto. Oh, that is a good cute. That's a cute little movie. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. No, my, my resident did not stink up the place. It, it doesn't have any smell. So I, this one, I got, it's from Purple um, Ladybug. And it didn't have any smell. So that I liked. And it dries real nice and clear. So here's the the coaster holder. Look how clear that is. Mm -hmm. So I got to make two more coasters for it. So I want to give it to actually three more because I didn't like the first one that, that, that is full of glitter. I didn't like it that much. I definitely need to make my hair glue mixture with Elmer's <laughs> the spray for styling because he can get the hair under control. All Doug right, guys. Just, oh, I'm tired. So we have had a big day. Doug is getting a new what? A new dog Doug and the dog's name dog. is Bruno. <laughs> mm. I think it's something finished though. My cat. I, I want one of Doug's doggies. They're so cute. I know he does have the cutest little dogs. They are adorbs. I gotta get some some um, 
large jump rings to make these into keychains. The little mm -hmm. hearts. Yeah, those are cool. So I will tell you one thing. This my glue smells. This glue smells so bad, and my face is like in it, and I'm like, oh, I don't like the way it smells. All right, so we're gonna call it a day. I don't even know how long we've been doing this. Three hours. Oh my gosh, we're doing it again. Anyway, but we it's a lot of work, guys. That always it's work, so much work. And little little teeny tiny things waiting on things to dry. But um my baby's looking really fuzzy, fuzzy and cute. Maybe fuzzy he was he was a bear. Take go slip, baby. And I got the two bodies wrapped, all that good stuff. So yeah, we got <laughs> Me too. I'm, that, me too. That, 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 I'm sorry. I got the two bodies wrapped. I got my bodies wrapped. And yeah. <laughs> and they're shrouds. Yeah. And she is, um, yeah, I'm not sure if I like, I think I like this look the best. It's kind of neat. I think I'll just stick to that. I was trying to tighten her up, make give her a figure. We'll see. Oh, yeah. Okay. So hopefully next time we see these people, they'll be putting getting their hair will be done. So anyway, thanks for watching everybody. The, the, the next time we see them, they'll be haunting the house. Yes, house. So. Well, no, the house ain't very ready to be haunted yet. But there goes a, a close-up picture of the books I made. They are amazing. They do. They look really old. I love them. <laughs> I love them so much. Those love are awesome. It. So anyway, we'll eat. Um, yes, I need to go eat. And this early here. Right? I'm, said. Still I'm still hungry. Bye, everybody. Thanks for watching and check us out and, you know, next Tuesday, if not sooner. Bye. It's really good. It's good.